Hello everyone, this is Illus here. We're back again with Trials in the Sky SC. Hey. Uh, actually, I think we are halfway through chapter 2. So, I think we might be able to finish it today and move on to chapter 3, hopefully. But yeah, the, ga the game per chapter is actually fairly long. Uh, especially if I want to do all the sideboard quests as well. So, yeah, let's take it slow so that I don't burn out. Oops. Yeah, so yeah, this is just probably I'll try to do it uh once per week or maybe more if I get very uh into the plot and want to like quickly know what's the story about. But yeah, for now I think we are in the early chapters and it's still a bit of a slow burn at the moment because they are like slowly revealing everything bit bit by bit. So yeah. Konnichiwa. Uh, Konnichiwa yes, hello, hello, hello. I'll, I'll refund you this one because you really redeemed the previous one. <laughs> yes, don't don't waste your points, man. Actually, you got a lot of points, but either way, yeah, <laughs> you can use it on something else instead. Right, yes, yes, yes. Hello, hello. Hope your Hong Kai impact is going well. And yes, hello, Des, too. Welcome, welcome. We will now begin with the game, I guess. Uh, I, I don't really remember where I left off, actually. Uh, something about ghosts? Wait, was it ghosts? No. Uh, earthquake, earthquake. Yeah, yeah. It was something about earthquake. So we'll have to... Never mind. We'll have to do all this first. <laughs> um, but... Oh, we have the Peeping Tom. And Helmo, Elmo Hot Springs, too. Uh, some parts have gone missing. Recruiting person. Eric. Okay. Yeah, let's head over there first. Because I think this is the nearest one. Ooh, our, our EP is fairly low. Huh? We can probably level soon though. Maybe, hopefully. But yes, let's talk to whoever I need to talk to. Eric, Eric. Who is Eric? This? Ah, welcome to the Central Factory Maintenance Desk. Are you looking for something? Yeah, never ending quest. Yeah, the side quest, especially the side quest. The side quest can get a little bit draggy if, if you want to continue for the main quest. Uh, but yeah, that's just how it is. Especially when you want to get your rank, uh, Bracer Guild rank up. Up. Oh. Hello, Zephyrs. Is wait, did did the troll actually happen? Wait, let me let me check. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, oh yeah yeah it did happen yes hello Zephyr ow 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 okay yes <laughs> you made your point you made your point <laughs> welcome welcome how are you doing uh aren't you the one looking for us me looking for wait ah are you guys braces then yeah we saw your request on the board ah th thanks for coming i really am in a bit of a fix anyway do you have time to hear about the problem Yes, so we have to go. Yeah, sure. To get right to it, it sounds like you are looking for something. Yes, I'm looking for some small augment parts. I was going around checking to see if the equipment in here was unharmed. Just tripping by. Yes, yes, thanks for tripping by. No worries, no worries. It's the thought that counts. <laughs> Man, I miss the BGM. Yeah, the BGM is so nice and very chilling too. Plus, yeah, plus it's like, I think it will be ongoing for all three games since uh, we will be in this region either way. So I don't think the BGM changes that much other than maybe certain battle or boss musics, I guess. Or new areas. So yeah, lots of nostalgia. I started SC, I was like, damn, they recycle the BGM and mess. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Then, then you realize, hey, that's actually a third game, man. Shit, <laughs> you have to play the map, same maps and same BGM for three times <laughs> before going to the next, uh, next city. <laughs> I was going around checking to see if the equipment in here was unharmed, but yeah, yeah, I think I think because that's why I, I slowed down uh the pace a bit so that I don't get burned out from from uh all this same same semi semi stuff yeah but uh, you know at least once per week so it, it's good it's good <laughs> and i guess they all spilled out of the hole in my pocket while i was moving around you had a hole in your pocket the you know you, i mean the, there's there's 
a hole in the pocket is normal, no? <laughs> how, how do you even put things if there's no hole in the pocket? Yeah, that do it. Y yeah, this is totally my mistake. Yeah, best is to enjoy the story and the pace. Yeah, I, I chong the first one, man, I think. But, but yeah, yeah, I think I think cause it's been a while since I played, so the first one I was still ha uh, very hyped for to to play like all the series. But after after starting the second game, I kind of slow down a bit. <laughs> Story's good either way, and it's a bit of a slow burn, so you we'll have to take it slow. I knew it was starting to tear, but well, I was freaking out when the earthquake happened, and I just stuffed them in my pocket without thinking. So they all fell out while we were walking around. I see. I think we get the situation. So the job is to find those parts. Yes, that's right. But many almond parts are very small. Searching for them sounds like it could be quite the task. Now that you mention it, that does sound like a pain. Yeah, I think so too. But fear not, I have a secret weapon for you. A secret weapon? Please use this. Metal detector. What's this? Uh, so, oh, 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 hello, Chris. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Today, you guys not playing game. I saw Louis was playing his Wolfenstein again. Uh, so this is a bit of an oddball metal detector we've invented. This metal detector can pinpoint specific meals, metals, or oh, meals, <laughs> bro, metals. They playing? You? You not playing? You need to what? Rush assignment or something? I need to clear some work. Is it for, for school? All the best man, hope you can finish it soon. So you can chill for the weekend man. In other words, you can select a specific material to search for. That that does sound pretty incredible but... What does it have to do with the job? A lot of course. Yeah, just looking at this discord, white noise. <laughs> when, when you get like distracted uh, when, when you do that cause... I don't know, I don't know, I know a lot of people uh, is able to do work with like background noises but wow, I, I sometimes cannot, I will just like end up um, being absorbed in whatever is happening in, uh, by the noise instead instead of doing my own work then my like, it keeps interrupting my thought process nah, still okay, I can tune them out uh, that's a skill I wish I have okay lah, it happens lah, but uh, it's very hard to get in the zone sometimes unfortunately for me but yes, 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 all the best with your work. Quickly finish it, quickly finish it. If you can. Uh. <laughs> I think I get it. If we set it to search just for the kind of metals used in the parts. So it will only respond to the parts then. Ah, okay, so that's how it works. Yes, exactly. Get close to something that looks promising, then use the detector. If there are any parts, there should be some kind of response. Yeah, got it. The machine will help, but we like to cut down the areas we have to search too. When you drop the parts, do you remember where you have been? I then go at zoning out from the conversation. Have <laughs> uh, it good. Uh, that's good and bad to it, I guess. <laughs> I was in the workshop on the third and the fourth, uh, third floor and the lab on the fourth floor. I've already checked the elevator and hallways, so focus your search on those two rooms. Third floor workshop and lab on the fourth floor. Alright, got it. I think there should be about 8 parts that I lost. If you could find at least half, it'd be a big help. We'll do our best. If you find any parts, we'll come back here. Yes, please do. I also ask you return the detector then. Got any other info? If not, we'll get going. Ah yeah, there is one more thing. Okay, alert. Okay, okay, thank you for the alert. And thanks for dropping by. I will, I will enjoy the game and the stream. <laughs> ah yeah, there is one more thing. Give the lab on the 4th floor a real one over. I played with Antione while I was up there for a bit. I'm sure I'll probably I probably drop a bunch of parts there. Antione? You mean the cat living in the factory? Yeah, that Antione. He can be pretty cute, but this time I'm kinda annoyed with him. Well, I mean, I'm not trying to blame him, but I'm sure I lost a lot of parts playing with him. Aww, now I feel kinda bad for Antione. <laughs> well, let's get moving. Good luck, I'm counting on you guys. Roger that, we'll be back when we find something. Bro, why are you blaming the cat for for dropping the stuff? You are the one who who want to play with the cat and drop the stuff. Can't blame him. 
Okay, so how am I supposed to use the meta detector? Do I have to keep going into the item every single time? Wait. Uh, items. Books. Okay. Ingredient. Item. Yes, use. Oh my god. Oh, this would be a pain, eh? What? Are you serious? Is there no like shortcut for it? Oh! One part? Altman parts, nice. It's hardcore. Okay, response in the vicinity. Maybe here? Very nearby, okay. How about here? Items. Okay. Bruh, seriously. What about here? Do we have to like... Oh, that's so specific eh? Oh my god. Okay, okay. Let's not... Let's not get caught up with this. We shall... <sighs> I can't believe the quest is like that. <laughs> floor which uh what is the fourth floor it's a this is a workshop then the fourth floor is laboratory laboratory lab 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 yes yes it is the lab. greenhouse corner between the device and the plants okay yeah this is like too much uh, yeah i have to like really go every single corner and try and search we can inter intercom Oh, oh. Okay. Let's get with two white. Two white. Oh, oh, here. Yeah. They're talking about this. That makes sense to have something like this inside. Oh, it's like an item inside, I mean. Come, come. between the metallic crits and the worst. Metallic crits here. Oh nice nice. Okay. Then Oh there's one with Antione. Oh like legit Antione just took it back with her. <laughs> Meow did she eat it? Don't tell me she ate it. Hey. Oh, oh, would you look at that? Antony, you sneaky little cat. So you were carrying one of the parts. That one would have been uh, easy to miss. Come to think of it, Eric said he played with him for a bit. Maybe he found the part and carried it back with him? I think so, but for him to bring it with him, man. So cute. <laughs> Sorry, Antione. We had to take your toy away. We will get Eric to make it up to you. See you later, Antione. Yeah. So cute. Bonus after finding. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I guess we are done with this quest. 
Oh, uh, the looking up a guide or rather like having a guide that hints you where the location is saves up so many time and rather than having to scan the whole whole room and yeah i i wouldn't have thought of uh going to Antione as well although like i read the conversation and they say pick Antione. <laughs> who knew man who knew such a surprise hey did ev hey everyone did you find any parts it's going okay i guess for now we'll report what we have got about finding eight parts wait did you did you really find all eight parts oh did we get them all it incredible i totally given up a anyway if you could give me the parts and the detector all right Whew, thank you so much i didn't think all the parts would be found <laughs> glad we could find them for you will this be enough for the job Hey, what is that emote? <laughs> My avatar. What, what is that even? <laughs> blushing, blushing. <though. laughs> yes, of course. I kind of feel bad making you go this far. Alright, ah, that reminds me. I had that. Here, please take this. I may not be much. It may not be much, but think of it as a symbol of my sincere and super relief thanks. Buzzer, ooh, equipment. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, same, I have no idea, man. Bro, it, it looks like a, a moustache man blushing, but I don't know what's the context of it, though. <laughs> wow, thank you. Are you sure we can have it? Yes, don't worry about it. You really saved my butt. Anyway, thanks again for today. Thanks to you guys, I should be able to catch, up, catch back up on work as I was doing. That's good, but um, you should really fix the hole in your pocket. Ah, uh, yeah, I should probably. I guess I better find a sewing kit. If you need help with that, just contact the guild. We'll arrive anytime, thread and needle in hand. <laughs> thanks for your thoughtfulness. Anyway, thanks again for today. I hope to see you again. You can leave the thread and needle behind though. Yeah, next time. Well then, later. Yeah, we are done. I'm just hit empty right now. Haven't done anything earlier. Still feel tired. Oh, did you just wake up? I, I, I would uh, be in that situation as well when I just woke up. I usually, if I wake up, I'll have to uh, take a while to like clear up my head or uh, put me into a mood to actually uh, want to do something. So yeah, I just go to the toilet, feed my cat, then we I sit in the chair in front of the comm and just blank out and do random shit. Nah, I'm actually going to sleep. Ah, then that's an even better situation for you, no? Wouldn't it be easier for you to sleep if that uh if you are in this uh mood at the moment? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Eliminate peeping tom. Maple leaf in. Okay, let's go to the maple leaf in. Where is the maple leaf in? Stains. Oh, the blue color thing, right? For go bar. Zanrat Hotel. Wait. Oh, wait. The maple leaf is not here. It's an L moon. Yaka. Trot planes. Soda Army Road. Where is Soda Army Road? Uh, Soda Army Road. Let's, let's go with the road here first. I know Trot planes is... Uh, where the Elmo Elmo thing is anyway, sung time. Yeah. It's fine because Wow Okay. Oh oh right, I took Tita with me. Tita is only level 40. Eh. She's so under level. Oh, okay, I found a way to Let's go. I don't know, sometimes if I'm tired, I'm too tired to sleep. Like my body thinks sleeping is doing. <laughs> yeah, I think I think that happens. It's like a very uh, normal thing for everyone. Like you want you know you want to sleep, but you, your body just refuses to do it and it just you know, it just takes time for your body to get get back into it to maybe want to sleep. I would rather really fall asleep instead of just uh, hanging in that limbo. 
Uh, yes, yes. Just, you know, take your time, chill a bit, and see how it goes. Maybe in a while, you will just feel tired enough to want to sleep. Ooh, meatballs. Oh, she leveled up. Okay, nice, nice. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully you'll be able to sleep soon. I mean, tomorrow is the weekend after all. You don't want to like, wake up in a bad mood or anything. Ooh, I, actually there's so many treasures that I just realized that I didn't even take. Boom. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Not really, just tired. I don't even know why. Yeah, it, it happens, it happens. Maybe... <laughs> I haven't done anything stressful. Yeah, I, I feel like uh, sometimes like even if you have like a very I don't know how to explain it like sedentary day or rather very relaxing day. Uh maybe it's like you probably relax too much to the point that your body is just in that slump, you know? <laughs> you just kinda got used kinda got used to it. And so so it's that like in that uh position. Even though, like, you are not supposed to be tired or anything. It happens, it happens. It's just, you know. Ooh. We have fight this. Okay. Wow, there's a lot of monsters. I guess I'll do that. Why did I take Tita with me? Oh, right, right. I have to take Tita with me. I can't help. Uh, there's no other options. Camphor 2... Craft. I guess you're right. I did skip my gains for a week now. I haven't had the time. Ah! Oh, yeah, actually that makes sense too, you know? Cause like, um... Like, I do hear people that like, uh... If they worked out and they suddenly stopped doing it, they will feel like uh, a certain like kind of weird after effects over it. Like your body become a bit restless or some sort. So that may be part of the side effect also. So I can't say I'm I'm not the very um how do how to say? At uh yeah, I'm not the type that likes to exercise, so... <laughs> Ooh, okay, okay. Come, come, come. Ooh. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, that was fast. Okay. Ooh. Okay, okay, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this first. Yes. Skinnyless. <laughs> More like fatless. Being a couch potato and everything <laughs> definitely doesn't help you to be skinny. <laughs> Although I have to say like, um, I think my arms and everything are probably on the skinny end. It's just that uh, cause of the lack of exercise, the parts where it gets fat easily is indeed fat, uh, filled with fats. Like your stomach, your legs, your, your thighs, those areas that are easily, uh, the, the, uh, where they easily gain the fats. Yeah. Unfortunately, I just don't really like exercising. And uh, going through 
our army just enforces it even more, <laughs> which is an unfortunate fact. Although I do like study health and stuff, and there's like all those theory that you'll get all the runners high or you'll feel uh the serotonin rush that makes you feel very uh how to say good when you, after exercising. Yeah, I I I don't I don't really feel those effects though. That's why that's why the more I exercise, the more uh I kind of hate it. I just feel like dying instead of, of ever feeling the effects or the great so-called great effects I studied when yeah all the theories didn't apply to me unfortunately although I know a lot of people who who get that feeling yeah I just didn't get that do you do you get it though I, I know some people like like really like like that feeling okay now to the L more L. Wait, where, where's the other monsters actually? Trapsins. Yaka, Yaka, Yaka at where? Yaka. Trapsins is so big though. Okay, tell me where is that? Okay, let's go the wolf for direction. I feel like it might have. Ah! I heard that there's a chance it as it yeah it's at the wolf fort direction. No. Okay, never mind. Oh my god, the range of my <laughs> tractors, man. Mall. Ah, oh, is it? Oh no, wait. That's the because sneak too. Die. Yeah. Oh, it does give a decent amount of EXP, which is nice, which is nice. EXPs are always welcome. I do like the feeling of sweating after a good exercise. The cooling down of muscles feels nice. Yeah, 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 that's the thing, that's the thing. So, you, you feel those kind of effects, which is actually a good thing. Because uh, it like, kind of, it's like kind of a motivation for people to exercise. Like, a lot of people like kind of get uh, quote unquote addicted to those feelings, I guess, which is yeah a positive thing, but yeah I, I just don't get it you know I, I don't really experience that sort of feeling even after, uh, exercising or maybe I just I'm just too focused on the negative aspects where I'm I really feel like dying so I end up just, um, uh, blocked out the those uh, experience you have felt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Unfortunate, unfortunate. That's all I can say, man. Ooh, Carnilla Tower is there too. Okay, let's actually go in first and am I still considered to be part of uh Trust splints, cause I can't tell, man. Then after the sleep, the muscle aches. Yeah. <laughs> but having muscle aches shows that you are doing uh things correctly, I guess. That's where it like kind of shows that your muscle are growing. So yeah, it's good, it's good. But do you still get it? Cause you have been exercising for quite a while. If that's the case, won't your body be like used to your routine anymore? Or do you like push yourself to the mi limit every time that's why? Cause yeah. Even during the time when I was in the uh, army, uh, it was only after a certain, uh, it was only for a period of time, uh, during training where I would get like muscle aches and uh, mus and, and keep getting muscle aches. But after a period of time, like after you are like um used to the training programs, it kinds of just it kind of just. Uh, stops so you don't actually feel that 
a uh, muscle ache that often anymore, I guess, or when do, do I even feel muscle ache anymore afterwards? I'm not sure. But yeah. Uh, ooh, so many ships here. I don't want to fight you though. Ooh, okay, you're chasing me. I do increase the intensity every other day of exercising. I see, I see. Makes sense, makes sense. I mean, if you want to like, push your uh, maximum limit or increase your maximum range or what, or whichever you are trying to do, yeah, it makes sense to keep trying to increase the intensity. Just don't overdo it. Just a bit though, not too much. Yeah, yeah, it, it's good to know when you have to stop or when to stop so you, you don't push or uh, overwork yourself. Moderation is key. Where, where, where is the monster that I have to eliminate, man? What? Come on. Oh, in my case, it's not pushing my limit, it's just it's reaching my previous. Oh, oh, like, is it because you haven't been exercising for a while and, like, you kind of regress? So you are trying to get back into it again? Yeah, but yeah, either either way is like makes sense, makes sense. Or rather You know, just gotta not overdo it. <laughs> Where am I going actually? I'm so lost. <laughs> Bruh, boss, can you can you come out already? I'm looking for you man. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, let me, let me let me just search for Yaka. This this plains is so big. I can't I can't find the monster for some reason. Oh, it's, it's, it is at the, where the Elmo village is. Well, how come I missed it? Here, right? Oh, no, wait, wrong. Before COVID, I'm at a constant 74kg or 70% muscle, 15% fat, and 15% water. Oh, wow. 74? Oh, oh that's, not, that's not bad, I think. Yeah, 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 that's not bad, that's not bad. So you are trying to get back to your pre-COVID uh, fitness level, is it? Okay, let's see. So let me, let me see the map though. What? Wait, I want to see the mini map, not... not yes, sir. Okay. okay, okay, correct direction. Oh, wait, wrong direction. Yes, 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 here. This is at uh, this very corner. Oh, so many ships. Nah, nah, nah. I don't want to, I don't want to fight all the ships. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can turn your camera doing... Wait, what? I, I ran... Oh, I guess I missed it. Huh. I see, I see. Whoa, oh my god, this is so disgusting. Okay. Craft, perhaps. I guess let's go for morale first. Uh, should I go one by one? What's the HP for each? 1.7k. 1.4k. I think I can go... Yeah. Okay, okay. That's... That's not bad, I guess. Uh, I guess. Assume the weakness is fire. Yeah, the weakness is fire. Oh. I see. Yeah, now I'm currently at 50%, 30% fat, 20% weight distribution, and weight fluctuates between 70 to 80 kg. Ah. But yeah, yeah, makes sense. Like, because, you know, 
after or rather like during COVID, it really increases your sedentary life, the rate of sedentary lifestyle, I guess. So, yeah, makes sense. A lot of people have been staying at home. There's like not much way to keep fit. I mean, there, there actually is like those home exercises, but I guess for some people, it's just not as efficient. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, hopefully you can get back to your uh pre-covid uh weight no not weight Ma muscle to fat ratio and everything sorry spin spin yes spin spin pew i miss oliver oliver has such a big aoe here why 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 is Tita's uh current AoE hit so small though? Weird. Not not small, it's just a range, it's very my mini, mini, mini range. Yes, yes. I'm sure if you keep out at it you will do good. It's just a matter of motivation and habit I guess. As long as you are able to uh, convert your gymming habits into a daily habit and it becomes like kind of automatic yeah it will become you will definitely become easier for you did i win here already i think i did right oh cool wait no wrong stores if you want some tea we got a problem with springs the problem with springs here Wait a minute, there's problem with the springs? I thought we just fixed it. What do you mean? What do you mean, bro? <laughs> right, I think I think here, right? Yes sir. Oh hello. Now what brought you all together today? We are here to stay the night, of course. Yeah, I wish. Keep dreaming, Estelle. Unfortunately, we are here for work today too. We saw the board. Seems like you've got some kind of problem. The board? Oh, that thing I contacted a guild about, eh? That's the one. Something about a peeping Tom creeping about? Yes, that's right. If you've got a minute, I'd like you to investigate immediately. Do you guys have the time right now? Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, no problem. It's, it's always uh, do you guys have a time now? If <laughs> if you are going to do the side quest anyway, of course we will say yes. Then we won't say no to reject the quest. Let's get right to it. Apparently, someone's been peeping on my guests. It's a recent thing, but I've heard tell from a number of my female guests in particular. I won't stand for it, so I contacted the guild. Ugh, peeping toms. Totally gross. When I find him, I'm going to rearrange his face with my stuff. What kind of specifics you have? Have you gotten from a guest? Did any of them see the criminal? No, no, nothing that clear. They have been reporting things like the feeling that someone's watching them or strange sounds. But nothing concrete, right? Could it be just be a misunderstanding? Hmm, I thought so too at first. But like I said before, I keep getting those same reports again and again. At this point, I just can't toss it aside saying it's a coincidence. That's certainly true, but it's kind of a problem. It's not even clear that this is a case, really. There's no way we can investigate properly without any specifics. If it ain't clear, then we just gotta put it to the test. Not like we could make an arrest unless we caught them in the act anyway. Test? Put what to the test exactly? That should be obvious. We are going to take a bath. You want us to be bait to lure out the criminal? I don't really mind, I guess, but I feel like for a certain portion of us, this might be a slight problem. <laughs> I'm not going to force anyone, however, I appreciate the help. The more bait we have, the more effective, I'm sure. Oh, don't mind me. I like to help in any way I can. I'm your support, so I hate to not be of assistance just when I'm needed. Sorry and thanks. Still not sure if we've got enough bait, but I guess this will have to work. Yeah, well, excuse me for not being sexy enough. 
Aw, give me a break. Even Tita's laughing at me. No, 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 I wasn't laughing at you. I was just kind of happy. It's been a while since the two of you, two of us took a bath together. Sounds sweet enough, sure. But, uh, you do know this is a totally exploitative bit plan, right? Anyway, would you mind lending us your outdoor bath, ma'am? Yeah, use it as you like. I'll reserve it entirely for you for a bit. So, you four go warm up yourself. Thanks, Miss Mao. Oof. I guess we are really doing this. Yep. Sure. Have a good time. Hey, wait a sec. A good time? You are not coming to the bath? The hell are you on? Why do I have to go into the bath? The better question is, why wouldn't you? You've come this far and yet you are not going to bathe? Well, I won't stand for it. Yeah, you are the one who came up with the plan in the first place. Wait, are you seriously embarrassed? Sh shut up. I'm not embarrassed. Work comes first and iron in exactly what we needed for this job. <laughs> Thanks for the hydrate redeem, Zephyrus. Hello, uh, Zephyr. <laughs> oh, I accidentally combined the starting and the ending of your name together. <laughs> I really enjoy it. Like, recently I just started to just buy uh, Ayataka green tea in huge bottles. I think it's like 1.5 liter or 2 liter maybe. And I just keep it in the fridge. So when I want to drink it, I just uh, pour part of it into uh, those uh, flasks, thermal flasks. Yeah, so it like keeps cold for at least a few hours and I don't have to worry about getting it, uh, it getting kind of warm. And it's very nice to drink every time. Green tea, yeah. It's a it's a brand called Ayataka. But is it called is that is that a brand actually? <coughs> but I'm sure if you uh search for that name in Google, you probably will find it. Yeah, but it's called Ayataka Green Tea. Yes, it's it's very refreshing to drink every time. Although I do think like after drinking for a while, my throat starts to get a bit dry. I think that's the effect of. Uh, effect of drinking too much tea though. <laughs> ah, what nonsense. You've got nothing to worry about if you are a man, so man up and get your butt in the bath. To come to a hot spring and not take a bath? Pfft, I've never heard anything more ridiculous. What she said? Jeez, that's enough. I get it, I get it. I'll go in, okay? Just don't forget that this is a job, you guys. Yep, no problem on that point. Right, Tita? Y y yeah, no problem. <laughs> ah, oh no. Miss Mao, could you lend me a towel set? Oh, did you forget yours, Tita? Yeah, I didn't think I'd be taking a bath. Oh, and some shampoo too, please. Wow, she doesn't mess around, does she? Not a care in the world. <laughs> yes, living in her own world. Oh right, I forget this is an open mix buff. What if the Peeping Tom is a raccoon or a monkey though? Those, those typical stereotype you get uh, when you're watching Japanese anime. It's either like things like monkey or raccoons. <laughs> ah, it's so relaxing. Yep, outdoor buffs are the best. Heh, <laughs> why, why, why did you heh? <laughs> it's not what I'm thinking of. <laughs> Yes, the wind feels wonderful. Chloe, have you been to this bath before? This game is the epitome of stereotype, no? Yes, it is. <laughs> it's the epitome of those uh, JRPG anime style stereotypes, man. <laughs> There's so much of it, I swear. I, I feel like Cole still has, uh, has even more of it. <laughs> No, this is my first time in an outdoor bath. When I came here publicly before, I just used the indoor area. Ah, gotcha. So, you have been here before? Still, this beats the indoor bath hand sound. Looking up at the blue sky like this is really nice. Hehe, <laughs> that's right. Last time we went was at night. It's nice to get in during the day too though. Since the air is a bit chilly, the hot water feels wonderful. <laughs> Sounds like you are a real bath connoisseur. Just what I expect from a local. 
The only time I got to dip myself in was on a natural one. Sadly, it got ruined. Oh, how come? What 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 happened during that? Uh, when you went for it, I I don't think I went to the open bath before though. The ones even in Japan I went was all indoors. Yeah, the ones in Singapore, uh, the indoor one is not too bad too. I think uh, there's one. Uh, I I know there's one in stadium. Uh, went a few times. It's not bad. The feeling of going to like a hot spring is always nice. <laughs> so, which do you prefer, Tita? A daytime buff or night? I like both. Ah, but season-wise, I like it best when it's snowing. S snow? That's like in the middle of wi in the middle of winter. Wouldn't you freeze your butt off outside? Too many vis visitors, garbage, and tourists. Ah, I see, I see. Like, you went, you went during a busy period, that's why, maybe. Yeah, but when it gets kind of crowded, it's just, uh... I guess not, not as great of an experience since, like, you have to squeeze, sort of, like, uh, squeeze in a bath. There's, like, limited space after all. Oh, it's fine. In the bath, the snow falling all around, but you're all snugly warm. I kind of like that feeling. How lovely, a bath in the snow. Yeah, that does sound pretty good. i love to do that once. Hey, don't get too caught up in talking. Especially you, Estelle. Remember our main job. Y yeah, I get that, Iget, but... Why did you leave your bandana on? Honestly, the way you look is kinda standoffish. <laughs> Whether I stand off or stand in, it's got nothing to do with you. I don't do anything without this on. Well, I guess everyone's free to do as they want, but... Ooh, Shadowverse. You don't wash your face with that thing on, right? Use common sense, will you? Of course I take it off then. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> it, yeah, he does take it off. Uh, are you two idiots? What the hell do you think I am? Hmm, I don't know, Egert. It seems really plausible for you. You seem like the type to do any crazy thing you set your mind to. Uh, you know, that and this are... Huh? Why are you so quiet all of a sudden? We have been great every time after exercise. Yeah, that actually sounds good to be honest. Those are uh, outdoor bathhouse or whatever you call it, like in uh, Japan. I'm not sure if other countries have, or is is it like a cust is it like is there like a custom in other countries as well? But yeah, it does sound nice. Unfortunately, we don't have it in Singapore, and it's very expensive to uh get access to one. To be honest, I think. Uh. The whole day, day, I think the one we went, it was it a whole day pass or I I can't remember, but it was, it it was close to fifty odd. And that's excluding like uh food and everything, so it's just the bath. Yeah, so if if we want to do it daily, I would have to be very rich, man. <coughs> I'll have to win the lottery for that to happen. Hmm. Looks like they are here. Ah, oh, the the peeping toms here. As the you see that brush, eh? You see that brush to the north, brush bush. Check it out, sub please, so they don't notice. G got it. <coughs> Am I just watching? Oh, is is it is that a sheep? Is that the sheep monster? It it does looks like something's there. Yeah, most likely that's our peeping tom. But what should we do? Even if we wanted to try to catch him, we can't lay a finger on him from there. <laughs> yeah, someone's need. Someone needs to get out and. Get out first and go around. Looks like that's our only chance. Choice. Alright, Estelle and I will go behind him. Princess, you two draw the enemy's attention. Yes, understood. I yes. Well then, let's... Wait, wh what? What is it? Look, they're gonna run. Hey, wait! Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all the sheep monsters. Estelle, after them. 
got, got it. <laughs> where where do we go though? Oh, there's so many, uh, all the different colors and everything. Hiya. Finally shown yourself, huh? Let's teach them a lesson. Oh, 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 oh my god, why, why do you guys start with having your spells on? Creepy ship, creepy ship. All of them are named on creepy ship, bruh. Why are they so tanky though? Wow, 7k eh. What the hell? Okay, never mind. Let's. I, I don't need a craft to. Uh, heartbreak. Heartbreak. Which one first? No. Yeah, I guess anyone works fine. Wait, what? Smoke cannon. Wait. What's going on here? Okay. Oh, they are under some kind of buff. I thought they are casting spell. Yes, all the ships. I, I was like look, looking to see what they are near. Ooh, they transform into what the hell? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> they, <come on. laughs> they combine like a Power Ranger Megazord. <laughs> Bro. Okay, let's cut punt it first. Oh, it resisted. Whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. Okay, let's see. Dragoner's Edge, Spiral. No, I, I, I definitely have to go in front, so let's just risk it. Uh, Craft Storm. Yep. <laughs> Whee! Oh! Oh, wow, that's cute. Okay, let's go uh, forward as well. Wow. T Tita's range is really very short. <laughs> okay, okay, that's not bad, not bad. How much health do they have? Ooh, 7k. That's even lesser than the main, uh, the boss ship though. The boss ship had, had like 8k. Wow, Rich? No. Let's chain. Let's tell. Smack him. Actually, now that I think about it, I want to see what's the ship's name again. Uh, what is it? Big Ship! <laughs> it's just named Big Ship. <laughs> it is big in it. So, two for legs, one, two for hand, and one for the main body. <laughs> That's a legit Megazord there. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. Smack her. I was wondering why were they immune for a moment. Ah, they took one whole turn to to gatai themselves. <laughs> that's so cute. Proxy puppet. Huh? That's it then. Yes, I believe this settles things. Oh, they all lie down on their belly. They're so cute. <laughs> I never thought they'd combine into one super creepy ship. I doubt they'll come back now that we have bloodied their noses. But just to be sure. Next time you go there, I'll make sure you aim breathing when you leave. Now, get out of here. <laughs> my, my. So the Peeping Tom turned out to be monsters. We can't be absolutely sure, but it's very likely. We taught them hard, a hard lesson though, so I don't think they'll bother you again. One or two of those guys, I understand. But don't you think it's a little weird that so many were coming? Hmm, it's very odd indeed. This is the first time we have had such a thing. Something must have happened. Maybe it has something to do with the earthquakes? <coughs> earthquakes? Hmm, well, I mean, sometimes monsters go a bit wild because of earthquakes. Maybe their habitat got messed up after a bad quake or something like that. I see, that's certainly believable. Believable, bleh, believable as it is, there's not much we can do about a natural disaster. If they show up again, I'll just have to give the guild a ring. 
Yeah, go for it. I'm always up for a chance to relax in your bath again. Well, if we are gonna come for a soak, I'd rather do it off the clock. <laughs> you guys are welcome in the bath anytime, on the job or no. I owe you for today. If anything comes up, you'll be the first I call. Yeah, later. Bye, Mrs. Mao. Yay. Eliminated creepy, super creepy ship. Let's go. Wait, uh, actually, uh, what's the main quest? Where where were we headed to for the main quest, actually? Russell, Septum, Device, Soft Mystery. Oh, we should. Oh, we were supposed to go to Layston Fortress. Where is Layston Fortress again? My memory is not doing me justice anymore. Crap, crap, crap. Thank you, thank you. We are, we are finally done with all the side quests actually. How long has it, has it been since I started? Almost one hour. It took almost one hour for us to finish all the side quests. And it's only four. Now we can continue on with the main story. Let's... Hopefully, we can finish it. Uh, chapter two today. Peeping Tom. Okay. Cut monster. So that one, sir. Yay, we are E rank now. Petrify. Sweet. Complete any mission? Come report to me. Yes, so, yes, so. Let's save. Uh, okay, all of them are like maxed out. I think, if I'm not wrong, it's Rita Road where we have to go. So, let's see. Sangtime Gate. Yes, definitely. Up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, 820 damage. That's so painful. Why is it all me, though? Okay, wait. Whoa, what the hell? Okay, anyway, I need to get rid of... Oh. I need to get rid of this first. Don't wanna... Have a random... Grasshopper start attacking me. No, wait, not Grasshopper. Praying Mantis, I mean. So that sometime gear... Fortress army, where, where is that? Huh? Listen, alright, oh, it's the Listen Fortress. Yes, yes, it's indeed this. Ah, oh, the so that army would force me off so much. Yeah, uh, if, if if they would just say it's Listen Fortress, that would be so much easier for my brain to process wherever I was supposed to go. <laughs> okay, let's go. We shall go to Listen Fortress. Woo! Fight some sheep. If only the normal creep ship can uh trans uh combine into one big mecha ship too, that would be so funny every time. <laughs> hey, back to Lainston Fortress once again. Okay, so we have some. Oh, we have to plant the device, right? Right, right. We have to plant three devices. That's why. Right, right. I totally forgot about it. Layston Fortress. I know we were just here to help with the training, but it still makes me feel kind of nostalgic. Hehe. <laughs> I kind of thought that too. It was at it was night when we were here last, so it feels different though. Happier maybe. Well, we did break in not that long ago. Looking back on how we did make it all, how we did mix it all the better. Uh, wait a moment. You actually. I'm um, a little amazed you managed to break into the legendary Laystone Fortress. I'm also not sure I should be hearing that. <laughs> Let's just say we had a trick up our sleeves and leave it at that. Anyway, let's get this measuring thing signed up. Ah, it might be a good idea to get permission from the gate guard before sticking anything in front of the fort. Kilika should have caught ahead, so this should be a snap. Alright then. Let's go, gate guard, let's go tell you everything we know. This is Layston Fortress, the headquarters of the Royal Army. I'm sorry, but civilians are not permitted entry at this time. I have to ask you to leave the premise at once. But bro, you just saw me recently. Can't you remember that I'm a Bracer? Um, but we are from the Bracer Guild. Oh right, you folks. Command already passed down word. You need to place some form of measuring device near the gate, right? Told you it'd be quick. So if it's it's cool if we put this thing wherever, you have permission. Go so go right ahead wherever you want. Well, 
anywhere except the road itself if you don't mind. We would prefer to keep that open for vehicle traffic. Sure, no problem. Okay, let's find a good place. Okay. Okay, where... Where do we actually... What? Oh. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Hello, Abby. <laughs> hello, hello. Alright, Tita. Where should we put this thing? Hmm, let me think. <laughs> yes, yes. Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? So, if we are not allowed to put it on the road... Hmm. There's a light nearby. But this should be far away enough, I think. Playing Overcook. Oh, oh, you are going to play Overcook now? Okay, okay, go and have fun. Are you, are you like, are you guys like close to uh finishing the game really? Like in terms of like story and stuff. Finish ready? Eh? Then what are you guys doing now? Trying to three star. And this is in that direction. So the angle, yep, this will be perfect. Just doing other small DLCs that is part of the game. Confirm 3 star, eh? <laughs> We are 4 star chef, please. <laughs> Not 5 star chef. <laughs> oh, oh, but... Oh, I didn't realize there's like still so many like DLCs and, and stuff for the game. I thought it's like a new, uh, new game, so there's only a base game uh, at the moment for it. Max in Overcooked is 4 star. Wait, there is 4 star? I thought, I thought Max is 3 star. Okay, I don't play Overcooked enough, that's why. I thought, uh, yeah, yeah. I always thought Overcooked Max was 3 stars. Uh, yes, yes. Pro Chef then, Pro Chef. <laughs> okay, okay. Have fun with your game. When you clear the entire story. Oh, they'll introduce you 4 star. Oh, oh, I didn't know that. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that means you guys like got new game plus, like unlock hard mode. Then you manage to clear all all of hard mode oh pro uh. really pro really <laughs> pro gamer move right there i know it's right in front of the sign but right here is the best spot for it should we set it up uh why not let's set up uh. why, why not yet okay i'll start setting it up give me just a minute all done Whoa, so this is what it looks like when it's all together. Wow. What's um this dish-like thing? Oh, that's a kind of antenna for broadcasting orbital waves called a parabolic antenna. It puts out really powerful orbital waves that can cover really long distances. It can even broadcast from inside a place like the Caldia Tunnel. Um, Tita? I heard that orbital waves weaken as they pass through obstacles. Can this dish really transmit through the Caldia Tunnel? Oh, um, according to Grandpa, the antenna can direct orbital waves. So even if you are in a cave, you can reflect it down the tunnel and bounce it off the walls until it reaches the exit. I see, my goodness. Professor Russell really is as much of a genius as he ha he's ever been. I guess I'm too much of a country girl to appreciate how incredible it is. This thing will transmit earthquake info back to us though, right? Um, not yet. I haven't started it up yet. Just need to flip the switch. Yay, now it works. Great work, Tita. The antenna looks kinda easy to break, but I guess monsters aren't gonna be a problem around here, huh? Uh-huh. Plus, this machine repels monsters like the road lamps. I don't think there will be a problem with placing them anywhere else either. No worries then. Cool. Well, it looks like you are certainly keeping busy. Hmm? What? What What does that even mean? Huh? Oh, is that... Ah! That? Cassius. Hello, Estelle. Everyone. It's been a while. I know it's a little late, but good work with your training, Estelle. Hey, good work. You don't know the half of it. What are you doing here anyway, Dad? Haha, <laughs> well, 
I am a member of the military just in case you forgot. This is the strategic headquarters for the Royal Army, so most of the army brass works here. Oh, okay. So you were in put in charge of the army, huh? Yes. Thanks in no small part to Morgan absolutely refusing to let go of the idea. In the end, let's say it came down to a battle of wills and I lost. Thanks to that, I have not had a moment's rest in days, weeks. I can't even track the passage of time anymore. Heh. <laughs> For a, for a workaholic like you, what's the problem? <laughs> Come on, Naked, be nice. I have to admit though, seeing you in a uniform felt weird as heck at first, but now that I've gotten used to it, you really, lo you really look at home in it. <laughs> Naturally. You realize, of course, that you gaze upon he who was once the great dandy of the Royal Army. Even Richard wasn't half the lady killer I was, knew it too. I'm sure Mom would be true to hear that, that. <laughs> I'm still glad. I heard you were really busy, so I've been a little worried, but it looks like you are okay. I'm surviving at least. Anyway, Jane passed along the report from the guild, so they have begun moving already. You found one in the in Ruan? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we found one, a foot soldier of Ouroboros. Like the report said, those son of dogs are probably even more dangerous than we figured. Any chance the military got an ace in the hole for those animals? Hmm. Honestly, if I could put together an agency to replace the intelligence division that helped, I've only just gotten the regular army and border garrison wielded back together and cohesive. And that was a challenge. For the moment, we have little choice but to rely on the resources of the guild to investigate. I'm hoping you can look into these bizarre earthquakes we have been having while you are at it. Son of a... figures. So, you're relying on me for once, Dad? Don't worry, I'll shower you in a in filial piety, piety and success too. <laughs> First time you have ever said something like that, Esther. Oh my god, what's with the spam? You look very good too. You really have become much more of a true bracer. I'm sure Joshua would be impressed as well. Oh, uh... <laughs> I uh, guess so. General Bright. <laughs> oh, Major Sid. Yo, Sid. Good to see you again. Oh, it sounds like you have met recently. Yes, sir. It was during the special training I mentioned. It was a huge succe success then, thanks to them. I see. It's good you took the initiative so well in my absence. Now that you are Lieutenant Colonel, I'll be expecting even greater things from you, you know? Otherwise, I'll never be able to re properly retire. Well, we can't have you retiring, retiring too early, sir. At least wait until General Morgan has retired first. <sighs> and that will be when he kills over at his desk, most likely. Anyway, Lieutenant Colonel, it sounded like you had some business with me. Yes, sir. Eh, yes sir, General Morgan will be arriving earlier than expected. He is due at the landing port within the hour. For the love. That man has exactly zero patience, I swear. As you can see, I have a meeting with some of the brass to attend. I'm sorry we can't talk longer, Estelle. No, it's okay. I'm glad we got the chance to ch uh, got the chance to chat, even for a little bit. So am I. Eget, I'm sorry to ask it of you, but please continue to watch over Estelle. She's a senior bracer now, but she still lacks, lacks experience. No worries, Cassius. I see you are hardworking. Eh, you are keeping up the hard work too, Tita. I imagine she can be a dunderhead of a sister sometimes, but help Estelle out as best as you can, okay? <laughs> Bruh, <laughs> getting shame. Thirsty. <laughs> I will, I promise. Oh, oh, about the analysis of the gospel unit. Grandpa said he found um an unexpected hint. I think he will want to talk to you soon. I see. Sounds like we can expect some headway soon. Give my best to the professor when you see him. <laughs> I will. And your highness, you have my deepest gratitude for helping my daughter. I'm aware of some of your other concerns, however. I think you should discuss them with a few of the people you know. 
Not just Her Majesty, but Captain Swatch and General Morgan as well. They both worry after you. I know. I intend to explain it to everyone soon and make them understand. This journey is something I need to do in order to find myself. <laughs> I'm sure you will find what you are looking for, Your Highness. Thank you, General Bright. It gives me strength to hear you say that. Well, if you'll pardon me. I won't have time to do much to help you directly, but if you find something too big for the guild, contact me anytime. I'll help you as much as I possibly can. Yeah, I'm counting on you if that happens, Dad. Good luck with your work. <laughs> I'll need to I'll need it to keep Morgan back off my back. <laughs> Let's go Lieutenant Colonel. Sir. Oh boy, I wonder what what is the dialogue when uh Casius Bright talks to uh who Olivia? Yeah. <laughs> I'm very curious about it. Like he doesn't really know Olivia, I think, so I'm even more curious what what is the dialogue they have with him. <laughs> Hmm, looks like that's even busier than I thought. We'll need to do our part as the guild. And more. You got it. Let's get some answers and leave the old man speechless. Anyway, we are all done here. Let's go set up the next device. Right. Oh my god. Oh, oh, the, it, it was on oh, the... I think very noisy, yeah. Got provincial, Eastern Fortress, check. Oh, stone circle and trap planes, I see. Okay. Let's get back to trap planes. Then we are, after that is the Caldea tunnel, right? Oh man, I went to trap planes and everything, but I totally forgot about going there to uh, set up that stupid thing. The stone circle though, I don't remember where the stone circle is to be honest. Is where the Elmo thing, uh, the Elmo village is, if I'm not wrong. So I have to uh, take some time to search it out again. Or was it near the tower? I really cannot remember actually. That's unfortunate too. We turn away. Zezu. I feel like we have to we have to clear some mobs at uh trust planes. Uh possibly Caldea Tunnel too, but there might be a chance we won't have to do anything at Caldea Tunnel. Yes, yes girl. You want to go out? Let me let me open the door for you then. Give me a moment. Strength is ridiculous, man. I swear. <laughs> she has the leg power. Smack, smack, smack. Nice. I'm kind of glad that I don't really have to spend time and try to level or grind a bit in order to keep up with uh the game because i really just want to have a carefree experience and experience the story without worrying about grinds of sorts okay i think yeah elmo village is okay let's actually check though is there a exit no there isn't okay so should be here right i assume Stone circle. It's not here, Lee. Eh? I don't think so. Or oh, is it the other map? Let's actually check it out. Ah! Wait, never mind. Don't want to fight. Uh, let me. Oh! No, no, no. Let me. Let me go. Let me go. Okay, yeah. Let's see. Ah, I see. Okay, go straight ahead. Ah. Bruh, you monsters keep ambushing me. That you better not run away, man. 
Ah, you ran away. What? Then don't ambush me if you're going to run away. Ruda. Okay. Oh. Hey, a treasure chest. Ha ha ha. We definitely will have to fight something. Mochi, what are you doing? That's right, this is where the book from the records room was hidden. The stone circle is still spooky as ever I see. I read about these pillars once. Apparently, they are believed to predate even ancient Zamoria. Zamorians, the ancient people who live on orbital energy and then vanished. The tetracyclic towers and the sealed area beneath Grenzel, Grenzel Castle are both Zamorian, right? Yeah, apparently. It's true this thing isn't remotely like those. Grandpa told me once that there's a really strong septium vein running beneath this area. He thought this place might have been important to religion a really long time ago. Curious, what is some weird? Hopefully I don't accidentally read into spoiler territory while I'm like looking for all these uh names and stuff on wiki. Uh, I feel like I'll always end up reading spoilers instead, which is fun. Which is just that sad. <laughs> I still have so many games to catch up and uh, I keep reading into spoilers. It's, this game, this series is too spoiler prone. Uh. It's been such a long uh, time since the first game was released after all. Uh, can't be helped. But man, that's it kind of sucks when you're trying to look up things you forget and you accidentally read, read, read and oh, the spoiler. And uh, shit. We may, which means it's a good place for examining the flow of a septium vein, I get it. Where should we put the measuring instrument though? Hmm, let's see. On top of the rock, obviously. <laughs> the ground here looks pretty solid. And it's not in the runes. Direction is good. Estelle, you work great here. Right here. Should we set it up? Sure. Okay, I'll start setting it up. Give me just a minute. <laughs> Tita is so good. All done. Well, flip that switch as hard as you can. Flipping now. Oh, ship again. Wah. What the? Oh no, more ships. We are surrounded. Son of a... They are after the quads in the device. Only one thing to do. Shred them. Are you going to transform too? Why are you sky ship? Ooh, I mean, yeah, makes sense. They are the color of the sky after all. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Ooh. Uh, let's see, yeah? No, let's not do fire. Okay. No, it's not going to smack any of them. Yeah, let's smack him. Die. From Can't fear. Uh, yeah, let's smack this. Okay. Yeah, target one by one. They are all fairly tanky. Oh my god, what the hell was there? Slip, slip. Alright. Smack this up. Then... Smack this. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, ooh they're actually quite big. Okay. It's not too bad, not too bad. Smack this. Shoot this. Sweet. Smack, smack, smack. Okay, last one. Oh! <laughs> That's unfortunate. Actually, on the campfield doesn't do damage. I thought it does. Oh, it doesn't. Last time, I think the first game it does, right? They got like a slight downgrade. Or maybe I remember wrongly. Sweet. 200 EXP for Tita. That's not bad, that's not bad. Oh boy. I think we got them all. 
Those were definitely the nastiest creepy ship thing like thingies I've ever fought. Those done dirty calculating probably one of the new monsters Elna was on about. That was scary. Tita, did they hurt you? Just let me know if you get even a scratch. I'll be happy to treat you. Ah, uh, <laughs> I'm okay. You all protected me. More importantly, I need to flip the switch. Alright, now we left the Caldia Tunnel. Yay, now it works. Good work, Tita. Anyway, that's two devices down. Let's go set up the last one. Okay. Okay, there's a treasure chest there. Let me take it. Oh, there's monsters inside. Oh my god, there's so many monsters. Ooh, okay, I can hit them. Nice. That's the... Ooh. Oh, sweet. I wonder if I can... Oh, uh, Daguna itch. No. Eh, does it hit the ship? Yeah, it does. Hit both of them. That's the thing I'm looking for. Okay, 11 HP. Nice, nice. Tita, can you hit that? Yeah. Sweet. Now it's you left, pink ship. Ah! bro, you ran away. What? Err. Uh, what did I get, though? Silver earring, that's nice. Alright, let's go 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 back to Zeis. Oh, that's a Oh there's so many stuff here. That's nice, nice, nice. Free stuff is always welcome. Especially when you don't even have to fight anything to get it. Haha. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Kaudia tunnel. Oh, oh my god, I don't want to fight you. Oh my god. Okay, like, it's just one. It's fine. Uh, I, I just want to get over and done with the quest, so... I'm not really into that looking for fights at the moment, you know? Let's go. Okay, so we have to go down to the basement. Wait, wait, actually before that, I should just check. Stone circle, basement... Uh, midpoint called their first bridge. Okay, uh, here. Okay, let's go. Oh, I thought we activated a cutscene. Really. Okay, should be there soon. I guess. Shouldn't take too long, lah. Actually, it's surprisingly very far. <laughs> Yep, it's a very long time. Oh, yes, should be here. Let's see. This is the place we are after. The first bridge in Caldia Tunnel, right? Uh huh. We just need to set up on either side of the bridge, I think. Um, I feel like there will be monster popping out of the water. There's an orbo charging device over here, so this is a bad spot. Which means, oh, she's going to the other end of the bridge. Okay, and point and the point the antenna down the tunnel just so yeah this should be okay. Estelle putting the device here should work. Should I set it up? Yes. Okay, I'll start setting it up. Give me just a minute. Same dialogue. <laughs> All done. Well, flip that switch as hard as you can. Flipping now. Oh, this is more, so much more straightforward as compared to the other two. Yay, now it works. Good work, squad. Hey, Estelle. Ooh. Huh? Oh, Annalise and Scara too. Oh, wow. We managed to run into them. Hehe, <laughs> it's been a while. I didn't think we'd meet up here of all places. This is certainly a coincidence. Wait. Oh my, is that Princess Claudia with you? Please, Scarza, it's Chloe, and hello. Estelle and I met again in Ruan, and I've been helped trying to lend a hand. I see. Well, thank you for helping Estelle, Chloe. <laughs> no, no, I really don't need thanks. Um, hi, Scarra, it's been a while. Oh my. And Tita here too? Alright, ah, Kilika mentioned getting Professor Russell help in investigating the earthquakes. You must be helping with that then. Hehe, <laughs> yep. 
Analyst. I think she's going to shout that Tita's very cute. Uh, Analyst? What's up? You're spacing out. I c c can't. I can't stop myself anymore. But You are the cutest thing. I cannot not hug you. So cute. So cute. So cute. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, alright. <laughs> Anna's Lay's love for cute things. Didn't I uh, call this at one point? You want to make sure she doesn't smolder, Tita. You say your name is Tita, right? I'm Annalise Elfie. You can just call me Annalise, okay? What? I... You're even cuter when you get all confused. Scara, I claim this cutie for the Bracer Guild. We are taking her with us. I know how you feel, but... I... Ah. I don't think it's a good idea. If I were you, I'd be worried about her big brother over there. What are you staring at me for? So, uh, Scara, why are you guys out here? Did you come looking for us? No, this is just a happy coincidence. We are on the trail of some clues concerning the Sky Bandits and the old intelligence division. Huh? The Sky Bandits and the intelli- You mean there are guys from- those still on the loose? That's right, there's still men from both that the army hasn't caught. You guys found some of some kind of clue? Well, the guild had witness calls pour, pouring in. Most of them aren't all that reliable though. We have been trying we have been investigating throughout the country, following up on some of the more reliable leads. Though I was curious. I heard one of the Ouroboros showed up in Ruan. Yeah. A weirdo in an opera suit calling himself the Phantom Thief. Even with that stupid costume, Guy was a powerhouse. If he really tried to fight us, it could have been bad for us. Whoa, Agit saying someone was tough? Oh bros really is dangerous in that case. More mysterious than dangerous I'd say. Well, remember if you need our help, call us anytime. If you use the guild orbital phone, you should be able to contact us quickly. Yeah, we'll do that. Ditto for you, Scara. If anything happens, get in touch with us. We'll be there in an instant. Good. I'll be counting on you. <laughs> it is nice to see you again, but this is hardly the place for a long talk. It's about time we move on. Oh yeah, it's too bad, but I guess you're right. Hey, don't take this the wrong way, but you are two women traveling alone. Make sure you don't bite off more than you can chew, okay? Whoa, whoa, Agat, being thoughtful. Hold the presses. I think the earth just shook again. What did I just say about biting off and chewing? <laughs> just kidding. He does have a point though. Thank you, Agat. We'll be careful as you should as should you. Stay well, everyone. Estelle, Tita. Next time we meet, let's hang out together. You bet. Uh, um, goodbye. Hmm, <laughs> I didn't think we'd meet up with Scara and Annalise here, out here. Oh, Tita, are you okay? I was kind of afraid Annalise would squeeze you like a grape. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. That was kind of surprising though. Uh, well, um, she's not a bad person, so forgive her, okay? Still the remnants of the bandits and the intelligence goons. Both groups seem to have secret society backing. If those two do a good job, we might get some valuable clues. We better do our best too. Anyway, so right here is fine, right? Yeah. We've got all the devices in place now too. Let's get back to Grams in the operation room at the central factory. Roger that. Fifth floor of the factory, right? Let's go, actually let's heal ourselves too, might as well. Since we are actually, uh, we an managed to get to a Obu station. Which is not a very common occurrence in this game. Okay, uh, SC is probably more common, but FC, FC not that common. Ah, worm worm. Ooh, ooh, little damage. Okay, 
Not bad. Not bad. Should be able to level soon. I think at the next dungeon we are heading to, which is probably the boss dungeon for chapter 2, we should be able to get uh, to 51. Ah, 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 stuck. Okay, let's go. Fifth floor. Teleport. Okay, come, come, come. It's a lab right. Operations. Professor Russell, we are connected to the first unit and are receiving telemetry now. Yes, I see. Good, the connection is perfect. And, and even better, it looks like things are rock solid. Secure our connections to the other two units at once. Understood, Professor. I think they know we succeeded already. I guess, man, this room is still the weirdest damn thing. <laughs> Oh, hello everyone. Hi, Mr. Murdoch. We've got the measuring devices set up like the professor asked. Yes, we saw. We got data pouring in from them already. So the capel is already running. <coughs> hey, Professor Russell's running some sort of program to sort the data now. In fact, connection to the second and third unit stable. Excellent, that's all three then. Now, let me see. Good, good. Both of them are still as a pawn. And all and we have link to all three units. Excellent. Ah everyone, wasn't expecting you back this quickly. As you can see, thanks to you, we are getting all the data we needed. Good work you for. <laughs> well, really all we did was carry the instrument bits. Sites. We are the ones getting a favor off of you. You should be thanking short stuff over here. She's the one who put them together like a pro. What? No, no, I, I didn't do anything special. No, no, you did very well. Even the transmitter are perfect. The signal we are receiving is marvelous. <laughs> well, yay. So we are all set up now, right, grandpa? Can I do anything else to help? No, we are as prepared as we can be, I think. I've programmed the capel to begin analysis automatically if a disturbance is detected in the septium veins. Now we just wait for an earthquake again. So we have pretty much hurried up hard to wait huh? <sighs> I don't know if I can stay calm just waiting for an earthquake to strike Zays again. I know what you mean. What if another earthquake hits the city directly? It's chilling. Don't suppose we have a plan in, ca in case that happens? We secured and locked down the factory for an earthquake. Even so, if the next earthquake is much stronger, it will be hard on us. At the very least, I can't imagine we will avoid property damage. Unfortunately, the capel here is the same. Strong enough vibrations could damage it, causing errors and making our experiments fail. So a prayer or tree to the goddess wouldn't go amiss everyone. I thought I was nervous before. <laughs> So, even the most advanced technology, st technology still needs the blessing of ideals. <laughs> Engineers can be really faithful, you know? I pray to a goddess a lot when I'm working really hard on something. She does have a point. I remember when Professor Russell was developing the first Orbo airship, I was going to the church three times a day. You, you, could, have have, you could have had a little faith in something other than the goddess Chief Murdoch. <laughs> After 39 failed experiments, could you blame me? <laughs> they have always been like this, haven't they? I think they have, yeah. Anyway, looks like we've got some time to kill. Wouldn't hurt to pop back in to the guild house and report in. Yes, go on ahead. We'll contact the guild should anything happen. Oh. Uh, speak of the devil. What? Uh, earthquake! Seems we don't have that much time to kill after all. All three instruments are reporting changes. The septium veins appear to be active. Continue monitoring. Don't take your eyes off for them for a second. If signals are interrupted, report immediately. Yes, sir. Now, let's see. Data still coming in from all three instruments. Given the direction, the seismic waves are headed the origin point of the tremblor. 
Tremblor? Coordinates are 1273378.02. Oh, very interesting. What do you mean? We know where the earthquake's epicenter is. It's Layston Fortress. What? That? Oh, hell. What is that at the corner there? You see this thing? <laughs> like, it looks like a picture of a golden retriever <laughs> or something. <laughs> you know, the, the sewer cover. <laughs> what What the? We are under attack. Calm down. It's just an earthquake. Hold your line. Stay in position. General cases. You... Hmm. It seems I was right. Ordering a work stoppage at the port was the right idea. Incredible. I didn't actually think there would be an earthquake as you predicted. Cassius, just what kind of magic did you use? What magic? It's just logic, Morgan. The logic of our, our foes' desires. After three rehearsals, it was simply a question of what made the most tempting target. Chief! We have received word from Liston Fortress. They have suffered a fairly large earthquake. We were right. W what happened? Is anyone hurt? Thankfully, there, do there don't seem to be any injuries. I think they mentioned they were prepared in advance. <sighs> Thank the goddess. Ha! <laughs> That's Cassius, alright. The man has a danger sense of a fox. Now then, the Kepel should have the results for us. Professor Russell checked the display analysis results. So, let's see. Oh, this is interesting. What is it, Professor? Did we learn something? I don't believe we have. According to this, the flows along the septum veins were altered significantly prior to the earthquake. The unusual flow gathered beneath a single location, apparently. Since it occurred quite close to the surface, it had little effect before beyond the immediate area. So that means... Oh hell. H hang on a second. You are saying someone's controlling septium veins in order to generate earthquake on purpose? So it's literally an earthquake weapon. That's horrific. You have the right of it. A weapon that can cause earthquakes anywhere with septium veins. But, but, but grandpa, controlling septium veins, is that even possible? It's well beyond the capabilities of any earth-moving technology I'm aware of. <coughs> I agree. However, we cannot deny the evidence in front of us. Someone has made it possible. Well, tough for them. Professor, can you use the data to figure out where the weapon is? If you can, we will go stop it. Yeah. Damn straight. Hmm, perhaps I can. Right. Pull back to the data at the start of the disturbance. Now, in what direction does the flow disturbance begin? I have it. 165.88 by negative 228.35. Huh? Tita, do you know where there is? I think so. Tita put out the map. The coordinates are searched from Z center, so... If 12 east... If, uh, if east 12 search... North 378 is Layston Fortress. East 165 Selch. South negative 228 Selch would be. What? 12 North. South? Elmo? Elmo? Is it Elmo? Wait. What, what? North something and. East one six Wolf Fort. Caudia Tunnel? Is it Elmo? Yeah, I think it'd be about there. What? Hell of a place to hide. It. <laughs> Elmo Village. So the origin of the disturbances is somewhere near the hot spring then. I can't say it for certain, but it certainly seems likely. <coughs> so do you plan what do you plan to do? Isn't it obvious? We are going to go check it out right now. Yeah, we need to move and fast. Indeed. So, Tita, go with them. 
They will need your knowledge and technical skill in their investigation. Oh, um, okay. I'll do everything I can to help, I promise. Well, uh, this might be kind of dangerous. On the, other, on the other hand, Tita will be a big help, so I sure can't say no. For the love of... Fine, whatever. You just be careful, okay, squirt? I will. I'll contact Elmo ahead of you. I'm sure Miss Mrs. Mao will be glad to help with your investigation. Thanks, Mr. Murdoch. Hazel, get Mrs. Mao at Elmo in on the line at once. Yes, sir. Alright, time for the dungeon dungeon at Elmo. I didn't expect it to be Elmo. I thought it would be Elmo. I was thinking of like the tower, but then I realized, hey, there's no option for Cornilla Tower. <laughs> I remain here and continue to analyze the data we are getting using the Capel. If I discover anything, I'll contact Elmo at once. Thanks, Professor. If we find anything, we'll call you right away. Excellent. Good luck, everyone. All right, let's get to Elmo. All right, since I'll be using Tita for quite a bit, let's actually go and get weapon for her. I think. I think. I think I was lacking weapon or something. I assume. Cause it's not possible for Tita to have such a short range, right? Slot Estelle. Estelle unlock all. Eager unlock all. Tita. Upgradable everything. Should I upgrade Chloe instead? I don't have enough. Uh. Nah, nah, let's do it later. After this chapter. Ow, 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 ow. Hello, welcome back, RB. You are done with your game? <laughs> or do you just drop by to throw something and that's it? <laughs> Okay, let's uh, uh let me buy weapons first. Where's arms and guts? Okay, I'm gonna go switch out. I dying really. Wait, how can I dying really? I keep saying onion as carrot as carrot as onion. <laughs> oh then say I cannot function anymore. I'm too tired for work already la. Okay, okay, go and have a good rest man. I hope you get energized and have a good time for the weekend. Yes, yes, good night, good night. Thanks for dropping by. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah. eh? No way. Eh? Oh, I already bought everything for Tita though. Oh well. Oh, yes, Sumi. Yes, oh, yes, Sumi. Yeah, I think Elmo. Yes. Hazel contact the main two target listen for whoever responsible doesn't have a lot of common sense. Be very careful as you go. Yeah, that's the plan. Nah, it's all now. Hurry. Yes. Do I have anything to report? Oh, nice. Sweet. Then careful. Yes, I'll be careful. Okay, there's no new stuff too. That's good, that's good. Okay, let's actually save. Let's go. It's kind of interesting that I don't have any... I already bought the max weapon for Tita, but I just realized, oh damn, her range is short. I thought her holding a cannon would mean that she has long range, but apparently no, it's a short range cannon. Nah, 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 I'm not going to fight. I have enough levels. We are just going to Elmo straight, find Mrs. Mao, and find uh, the the underground Zemurian uh, tech uh, facility. Ah, good, good. You are here. Mrs. Mao. Mao, Mao. Mao, Mao, Mao. Hello again. Murdoch called ahead of you lot. You lot. Told me what's happening. There have been earthquakes all over the region, eh? Odd. <coughs> Odd. <laughs> <coughs> okay, never mind. I need to drink some water. But my throat suddenly like, feels like it got, it got stuck. I don't know why, but this always happens when I'm playing like Trials in the Sky games. <coughs> Maybe I talk too much or read the script uh, dialogues too much every time. But when I think I don't think this happens that much when I was when I'm playing other games also. So which is a bit odd, but uh, what to do? Oh, nothing. This whole thing is bizarre. But maybe you can help us. Actually, i like to turn that around. I was about to contact the guild anyway. Something strange had just happened a few hours ago. What? An earthquake hit here too? 
I almost wish an earthquake might be less destructive. Well, pictures worth a thousand words, eh? Come see for yourself. Oh, is that why the the shopkeeper said that uh the hot spring is non functional at the moment? I guess the dialogue was a bit too ahead in progress as compared to where we were. <laughs> what in the the springs are boiling over. What the hell? It's not supposed to get this hot. Believe me, I'd like to know what's going on here too. Right after I got off the phone with Murdoch, I heard a big fuss out here. I came out to see what was going on and found this. Maybe the pump is broken somehow? It might be emitting heat. Or oh, wait, no, it couldn't heat all this water. No, the pump's working just fine. I just checked a second ago. The way I see it, something at the source of the springs must have changed. So, I'm guessing temperature changes like this aren't too common. It's never happened while I've been here. And I've been here half a century. It's worrying to say the least. To be honest, this may have something to do with the earthquakes here. If something is stimulating the septum veins, might that heat the water further? Um, that's really likely actually. And if the water keeps getting hotter, the springs will be too dangerous to live near. Like heck we will let that happen. Come on, let's go find the problem. Ma'am, where is the spring source? Can we go check it out? I thought you might ask that. So I fished this out of the back of the drawer. Go on, take it. Wooden gate key. Ooh, a key? Mm-hmm. It's the key to the wooden gate near the pump shed. The cave down to the source of the springs is that way. Sweet. Thanks, Mrs. Mao. I didn't know there was a cave like that. Heh. <laughs> Thanks for getting things ready for us, ma'am. Oh, don't worry. We are the ones asking you a favor after all. I can't let the customer boil themselves like eggs, and we can't even use the water, our water for washing. I'm counting on you all to get to the bottom of this. You can, you can bet we will. Yes, so let's go. I to see their reactions though. You know, if not every day, you'll see boiling hot water. Well, wait. We will be entering the cave. We know a little about to investigate the temperature increase and the earthquakes. I think it'll be wise to make absolutely sure we are prepared to, before we go in. Yeah, just might find who we are looking for inside. Let's make sure we go in loaded and ready. Yes, so oh, how can we boil boil it like this? It'll be hard to boil in. It'll be hard boil in a second. <laughs> The, the hot water boiling. Is this really happening? Yes. Sir. What a scoop. I, I've got to get my camera ready and grab a picture. No, no, wait. Shouldn't I get the situation written down first? Okay, calm down. Think calmly. Mm, yeah, first I need to grab some photos. Oh, all right, time to shoot. <laughs> it's so nervous. Good luck investigating if things continue. We are out of business. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh, I, I guess that's what he meant. Like, Hospital no good in can't keep up business. Yeah, I guess that's what they meant, like, as in the cause of the small, all the three different earthquakes that activate, it changes the septum ring a little and a little, so that's why. What's being done for so am I? Please hurry and fix it. Stall this and die a patient in each of bathing gas. Yeah, good luck, good luck. Okay, I think it's, wait, it's not here. Pump shed. Oh, it's here. Did we, do you? Was it here the last time? Maybe it was. And they really prepared. That means they really kind of prepared it. The last game. Preparing things ahead, man. Smart Ooh, what is this? Is this the cave we are supposed to go to? Wait. Maybe it is. Oh, it is, it is. I see. Oh, the cave is smoking. The cave is smoking, though. Oosh, cool. Hot springs, fountain hit. Oh, oh, that's so cool. Wowza, it's really boiling in here. <laughs> if you fell in there, the burns could kill you. It's scary. The water is certainly dangerous, but even I'm even more worried about the steam. <coughs> the steam is harder to avoid and just as hot as dangerous as the water. Yeah, good point. Looks like there's a pattern to when they blow. 
We have to time our movements carefully. Okay, follow me. Okay, let, let, let's see. Oh, okay then. They aren't too strong. Ooh, and they give a hefty amount of EXP. Yes, definitely can level here. Right. Ooh, there's, oh, there's four monsters. Hey, right, luck cactus. Ooh. One, three, three, yes, three. Not bad, not bad. Eh, I wish I would go in front. Where does this lead to, though? What the hell is that? Okay. Swarm of evil. Ooh. Yeah, let's get rid of whatever we can get rid of us. Uh. Okay, nice, nice. What is Swarm of Evil though? Is it something that happens when he dies? Like something that activates when he oh Got petrified. Nice amount of EXP though. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Oh my god. I think the fact that, that there's no like... Ah... Uh, oh. Okay, I guess I went through. Oh, so... Correct. Area. Maybe. Oh! Mosquito! That disgusting big ass mosquito! Yeah. Ooh. Oh, you can heal. I thought, I thought when they meant you can heal, they meant like you can heal by uh, sucking the living shit out, yeah? Where am I supposed to go actually? Ooh, treasure chest, huh? There's so many monsters. Ta-ta! Oh no. Ooh, that's a huge ass debuff there. Can he only debuff? That would be unfortunate for you if, if that's the only thing he can do. Oh! I don't really know where she should be headed to, to be honest. It's it's a bit confusing without the uh map to know where I I can go and where I, where is a dead end where it's not a dead end, and I don't really feel like backtracking since uh I'm not I'm not really sure where I'm going to and I'm I'm not confident that I can remember where is the correct route I need to backtrack to. <laughs> so yeah, if I actually walk into the correct place, I will just continue walking. It doesn't really encourage exploration for me. <laughs> okay. Hopefully I'm going the right way though. I don't really want to. Oh! I guess I'm in the right place. Since I activated a cutscene. Hey, the water isn't boiling here. Ah, it looks like just the right temperature for a bath. I must admit, after all our toys, a bath would feel very, very nice. You got that right. The water does look like does look really good. Wouldn't hurt to dip our feet in, right? Fine, go ahead. Just don't take too long. I guess it's to heal. Why, why, why the sudden, why the sudden, uh, does it heal? Anyway, you gotta equip Tita with a new weapon. Yeah. Hopefully it increases your range though. What is all this? Yeah, Tita can use a gladiator headband, no problem. Buzzer. Uh, I guess that works. Okay. 
Yeah, all the equipped something. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, wait. What about Opmans though? Okay. Okay, she's equipped. Oh. Let's equip Chloe first. Since I use her quite a bit. Oh, wait. Mine too. Uh, action speed. Yeah, cast 2 is good. Then, I think for her defense at like survival, yeah, survivability and speed for her will be good. Then for Tita will be attack. <laughs> petrify, oh, Okay, I think Petrify would be decent for her. And uh, yeah, to hit. Sure. 15% success rate only though. Uh, let's just use shield instead. Gotta get that defense for her since she's a little bit paper uh, due to being a range unit. Where am I supposed to go again? Here? Oh. Ooh. What the heck is. It's spreading all over the ground. Glowing veins of. No, no way. It can't be. Hehehe. <laughs> You sure know how to keep a guy waiting? Hey! Is that? Oh, it's not. Oh, I, thought it's the, I thought it's the same person. A man with sunglasses. And a pole. And on the pole. Oh, hell. Another gospel? Evening, ladies. Good of you to come all the way out here. Oh my god, this BGM is so good though. I'll do what I can to make you feel nice and welcome. You, you are one of Ouroboros Tucks, aren't you? <laughs> Enforcer no B I I I B I I is what it is it Walter the Dire Wolf That's what they call me at any rate I knew it Let me guess you are the one behind all these earthquakes right Come on Let's knock it off with the obvious and just get down to it This pole is a little trick the society brains came up with to mess with the septium veins it normally just screws with the vein directly beneath it. You plug a gospel onto this thing though, you can cause a local earthquake or two. That's what I was asked to test. You were asked to? Your tests are finished then? Yeah, real shame too. What I wanted to do was work out enough power to shatter buildings. Couldn't quite get it to hit with that much force though. Wait, but, but, but. If the buildings collapse, all the people inside will get hurt. Heh, <laughs> you catch on quick, little girly. Some of them will get crushed under the rubble, their arms and legs mashed into jelly, left screaming like pigs. Others, they get quick deaths, head shattered like eggs, spilling their brains out on the road for everyone to see. Hey, I've got an idea. How about we do that to you instead? That blonde head of yours looks pretty fragile to me. Ah, no! Get away! You unbelievable son of a... Ah, Now, what's with those faces? I've been doing you all a favor, you see. I just think the dreary, soggy porridge of most people's life needs a little spice. Thrills and suspense, you know. The kind that leaves you in a cold sweat. Pushed to the point where you could die at any second. Come on, don't tell me I don't have your heart pounding. What are you, some kind of psycho? I get it now though. You were luring us in here, weren't you? What? You allowed yourself to be seen all over the region, and Elmo's hot spring boiled over immediately after the earthquake at Laystern Fortress. You were issuing a challenge to us, weren't you? Oh crap. Heh. <laughs> well, close enough for bracer work, I guess. Enough talk. Let's see what you are made of. Oh, he just stopped the music himself. Ooh, what the heck? Eee? What the heck are those? There are some worms that live in this area. Apparently, when you stimulate the septum veins, they grow as huge as they are. These guys are. Well, have fun, ladies. Oh, what the heck is this? You rotten coward! Fight us fair and square. Forget him. We need to take care of those things first. Defense yourself. Yeah. When my speech is like off, really. Okay, okay. Oh my god, there's so many. 
Okay, let's, how much? Uh, it won't be 3k. Okay, let's get rid of the flies first, though. Ooh, wow, wow. Tall, eh? Okay, okay. At least I get an idea of what to do. What about crowd? We should. AT DLA. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's slowly, slowly, vital cannon. Wait, uh, smoke cannon, smoke cannon. Okay. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Uh, since, yeah. Yeah, speed out and attack too, but no, actually I can smoke cannon. Yeah. Ooh, 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 what the? Oh, you can do half quick. In the. Okay, nice, nice, nice. We're one down at the very least. Oh, we are very big. Okay. Let's see, 3.6 here. Okay, let's do this, eh? Okay. Ooh, pain. Okay, I guess I'll have to use Tita to heal soon. Uh, who is Aegis Snakes? Can I? No. Let's go and whack him. Whack him. Whack him. Then Croft, Vital Cannon. Heal this too. You know, Tita's heal is quite a lot. 1.5k. Hello, Topoki. Hey, thank you for the hydrate redeem. Delulu and Happy. <laughs> what, what, what does that mean? <laughs> Are you like happy for your weekend? How was your week for you? <laughs> oh. Wow. Road. Gotta hang in there. Smacker. Midweek could have been better. Is it cause of the situation you were talking about that time? Has has not been resolved yet, is it? Okay, that's uh what was this supposed to do? Yeah, let's shoot this. Whoom! Craft. Comet. Smack this. Oh, almost, almost. I think my stars are aligning at the wrong times, but at least it's aligning. <coughs> well, I, yeah, wrong time. What was the term again? Yeah, yeah, but yeah. <laughs> My brain is just not loading anymore. How to stop all else from gossiping? You tell me. <coughs> yeah, I mean you can't you can't stop it, but you know, and are they like still? I mean, I mean you mentioned that time they were like push still. Uh, they are like trying to push you towards you know with the other guy. But if they are if they are stopped doing it, then I guess it kind of makes it a little better. Even though you can't stop the gossiping, but at least they are not trying to actively make make things happen. Wrong time, wrong place. Wrong time, wrong place. No, but you say something's aligning, right? so so technically, just wrong time. But I don't know about the wrong place part, lah. <laughs> I'm just surviving it with, with it at this point. Ah, uh, hopefully it doesn't like make you. Break, uh. you know. Hopefully, it doesn't go over your limit. Oh, that's painful. Okay, let's actually heal. Tell us, revise and heal. Oh, six point five here HP. Though. I think this is good. Yeah, yeah, I get what you mean. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> well, I find that every time. Uh, when I want to say something, my brain just uh, automatically stops working and I cannot find the correct word for it anymore. I don't know why. 
survival of the fittest, yeah. <laughs> Are you going to kick the auntie's ass? <laughs> it's okay, it's Friday, brain not braining day. I think it's an everyday thing at this point. <laughs> brain just don't want to work anymore, you know. It gets what I it gets it gets what I want. It gets that I don't I want to retire already and it's already doing its job for me. <laughs> Even though it's it's not supposed to do that. That's why the Lulu and Happy <laughs> Happy about the weekends, man. Yes. <laughs> okay, we managed to win. And I think I still have the most of my limbs. Whew. <sighs> Those creatures were incredibly powerful. Hmm. I might have expected a bit much. I thought that fight would be a little less pathetic. Don't underestimate us, pal. We have killed monsters like that plenty of times. Screw it. This is just sad. I didn't think you'd be you'd be this weak. The hell? I'm disappointed in you, worms. Oh no! Oh, oh wow! This is bullshit. Lowe was talking out of his ass again. It tells me the Divine Blade isn't the only one in Libro who might give me a run for my money. And this is what I get? Gotta be kidding me. Well, nothing for it then. I'll just have to sweet talk the professor into letting me hunt old Fangboy. He'll be a little more exciting than this at least. What? H hold on. What? You can still talk? You disgusting sickle. Listen to me. If you mean Joshua when you say fangboy, I will never let you hurt him. Estelle, I give you props on taking my punch and still being able to stand, but give it up. I can see your knees buckling. You really think I care about that? I'll find Joshua. I'll bring him home. And I won't let scum like you get in my way. Estelle, you get why they call me the dire wolf, right? I don't hold back for women or kids, or both. You are a martial artist, sort of. I hope you know what you're asking for by pointing that thing at me. Of course I do. If you think you can beat me, come on. <laughs> nice. Tell you what, I respect your guts. You'll die in one blow. I'll make it quick. No, Estelle. Estelle, run, damn it. Die. Ooh. What happened? Is it Olivia? What? Ha! Oh! Hey! Friend! Eastern Giant. <laughs> I forget his name really, but yeah. Heh. A perfect entrance, my friend. Olivia? And Zin? Hey Estelle, feels like it's been ages. I mean to come sooner, but work back home took longer than I expected. I'm glad to see I made it in time. Jeez, did you have to wait till the last second, man? <laughs> so, you are the A rank bracer Lowe mentioned? Perfect. Been a while, Zin. That's right, Walter. I hardly expected to meet you here, of all places though. I always knew you had the mind of a wolf, but tell me, when did you develop the heart and loyalty of a serpent? Oh, that be right after we last met. I've been having the time of my life since I joined the society too. You blind fool. Do you even realize what you have done? What you are doing? You break master's heart to see. Oh, spare me the righteous crap trap. You know better than anyone the path I've chosen. You keep talking nonsense and I'll kill you, got it? I wonder, do you even know? Kilikas up there in Zeus. What? She's been working there as the guild, rece guild receptionist for the past two years. Before then, she was wandering the continent. The hell? Why bother coming to a backwater place like Libro? What she's thinking? I don't know either, to be honest. But I do know that even now, she wants to see you. 
set aside this Ouroboros madness, Walter. Go see. Ugh. I told you, talk nonsense, I kill you. Heh <laughs> well hey, forget Kaleka. You being here just made my year. This plan of the professor is gonna be a whole lot of fun. Wait, Walter. You ladies keep working on your Kung Fu once you next time. See ya. Oh, he just... Oh, what? He just disappeared. Walter! Um, thanks for saving us, Zin. Why are you here, though? I stopped by Zay's branch and Kilika began fussing at me a little. She told me to hurry on over to Elmo and to join forces with you. And do you think I will miss an entrance this spectacular? I simply had to come as well. So, we have Kilika to thank. Well, thank you too. You really saved us there. All that aside, you actually know that Psycho Zin? How's that shake out? He's... He's an old acquaintance. I'll explain in detail once we return to the guild. With Walter's device gone, the dragon vein are calming, so the hot spring should cool down. Estelle Group took the chance to relax in the hot springs once they returned to the surface before going back to Zay's. I see. So the man in sunglasses was Walter. As I thought. Yeah, wait, what? As you, you suspected from the beginning? When I heard his physical description and clothing, I thought it might be possible. More to the point, you were careless. How could you allow him to escape with a gospel? Oh, come on. I didn't think it was that important. Did you forget that you are the one who shoved me off toward Elmo without so much as half an explanation? That was a mistake on my part, yes. I thought, however, you wouldn't need me to spell out every single detail for you, Zin. Ah, uh, you are far less cute when you do that, you know. Regardless, Estelle Bright, your investigation into the earthquakes is, is complete. Allow me to give you your compensation for this mission. <coughs> Yay! Ooh, 8 BP, that's not bad. Yay, We're slowly going up. Thanks, Kalika. Well, uh, it sounds like you two know what nut in the glasses. Oh, uh, know that nut in the glasses. What's up with him? We do. How do I even begin? Quite simply, Zin. Walter and I, we were fellow students. Walter was the elder student? Elder student? You mean your elder in martial arts? Well, to be precise, Kalika wasn't a student. Or just a student, anyway. She was Master Ryuga's... My part does not matter. Walter is a student of the Taito style. And six years ago, he left the dojo and it seems he was recruited by Ouroboros soon after. That should explain everything. Kilika. Nah, don't worry. I think that is all we need to hear. So he uses the same Taito style you guys use, huh? That explains why he hits like a freaking airship at any rate. He's even stronger now than he was in the dojo. It's safe to say he's a true master of the style now, I think. What is properly safe to say is that he's incredibly dangerous. It seems likely we won't be dealing with any earthquake, however, with any more earthquakes, however. It is probably safe to relax our gut a bit. Seems like it. I'll let the citizens know and workers know. They use yet another gospel though, and they were using it in conjunction with some kind of machine which could stimulate septum veins. Also remember that Blue Blanc did with that with that hologram projector beneath the academy. Whatever the gospel may be, it is definitely capable of forcing other orbo devices into feats which is great which greatly exceed their original designs. I believe you are correct, Milady. Holographic projection and excitement of septium veins are both possible in theory. What they do with this gospel, however, is completely beyond our understanding of orbo technology. And I don't mean just my understanding. I can't imagine anyone I know at any famous factory managing any better. It's true. 
I doubt either the Vern company in Calva or the Rainford company in, M in the Empire could do such things. Hey, Rainford company. <laughs> yeah, that's a familiar name. Even the Epstein Foundation, for all its progress in tactical augments, couldn't manage such feats. In other words, the society got crazy super technology nobody else does. Indeed, they must have someone of tremendous genius and skill working for them. <laughs> well, I'll just have to show them what for. Grandpa, I suppose we have no choice now. We've finished the Arceus new Orbo engine too, so we have free capacity. We'll devote the central factory to re uh, full resource to analyze the gospel sample we have. Ha, <laughs> of course we will. If you can figure out what the gospels are, it'll be a big help. I mean, who knows what else they are going to use them for after this. Both those clowns kept babbling on about experiments too. They aren't going to stop at two, there'll be a third time. If Professor Russell will be taking care of the analysis of gospel, I believe it would be best if your group move on, Esther. Yeah, I agree. We didn't catch the bad guy, but there won't be any more earthquakes at least. Any suggestion on where to go next, Kilika? The central branch of the guild in Grand Cell sent us a request for it. They claim to have received an official mission directly from the leadership of the Royal Army. The Royal Army? You mean from that? They did not share any details. They did, however, request all of you by name. There is a good chance this involves Ouroboros. Probably, yeah. <laughs> well, if they are inviting us, we can't say no, can we? Then it's decided. Once we finish our last bits of business, business in this, let us board the next flight to the capital. Sounds like a... Wait, we? Zin, are you coming with us? Hey now, why do you think I came all the way back here? Not only is Walter on the prowl, but you are still searching for Joshua, yes? You can bet I'll help you, in any way I can. Aww, thanks Zin. To be honest, I'll be glad to have you with us. Your wolf friend nearly beat us into raw meat. If you'd be willing, I'd like to train with you to fight him. Haha, <laughs> that's a bit humble for you, Eget. You usually possess more confidence in your own abilities, but very well. Hey, I ain't so thick that I don't see how good you are. <coughs> um, Estelle, Eget, can I come too? Huh? What? Well, um, the society might use more weird devices or more gospels. I, um, I think I might be able to help if they do. Please take me with you. But, but... Grams, what do you think? Well, I have to say that the granddaughter in me is filled with terror at the mere idea. Oh, grandfather in me. <laughs> but as you can see, my little Tita is quite stubborn. And I want to make her dreams possible whenever I can. Go ahead, Tita. I won't stop you. Grandpa. The Ouroboros clearly have a greater technological age than we could have ever imagined. <laughs> the granddaughter, eh? Anyway. <laughs> I read, 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 read until I blur, eh? The moment I read, finish the sentence, I was like, hmm. <laughs> what, what does, what is he even saying, man? <laughs> Uh, it's so hard man No brain not working leh. Yeah But actually I, I find that it's very hard for me To like read this kind of dialogue it's Like every time um, I have a habit of reading the start And the end Then I somehow go and jumble out Whatever words uh, in, in between and, and read it in my own way Which sometimes doesn't make sense And sometimes it's just I don't know. I, I don't know why my brain is just clearly built that way. <laughs> so every time I read all these dialogues, right, I have, I have a, like, a hard time reading it word for word. That's me when reading Chinese words. <laughs> How does that work for Chinese though? I, I find that, that that seems to be even harder. Eh? Plus, in the first place, I have a hard time even deciphering what some of the Chinese words are, so <laughs> I don't even have the time to jumble it out. I'll be like stuck stuck at like one word and thinking, oh, what the hell is this? 
How am I supposed to make, make sense of it with the next word? I tend to swap the words position. Does it even make sense in the end? <laughs> I feel like if even in English, uh, in English, if you kind of swap the words around, most of the time it still kind of makes sense. Just that maybe it doesn't uh have the correct meaning or the proper meaning the dialogue was trying to display. But Chinese, so like mei nu, I could say nu mei. Yeah, that yeah. I mean that that. I, I don't know. I, does, does does it make sense? I mean, you could. People will kind of understand, but. Bao zha and zha bao. Oh yeah, yeah. This does make sense though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I, I feel like Chinese might be a little bit harder. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, yeah. For the most part, lah. But zha bao zha and zha bao kind of kind of make sense though in my head. I don't know why. <laughs> I feel like "zapao" might be a word. <laughs> In that sense, Tita is absolutely correct. She could be a great help to you. I'd say you are getting quite a deal. You are not selling a new product here, Professor. Uh, I admit having Tita along would really help, but... <laughs> But if someone like that a man attack us again, I... No, it's okay. We'll keep your granddaughter safe, no matter what. Hey, Agat? Oh? What? what? What's gotten into you? I figured you'd be the one who yelled loudest about this. Between that clown and what we learned from the psycho, I think it's safe to say the society gives not one damn about the safety of civilians. That means there's no guarantee that Zayce is any more safe than anywhere really. So given that, what the hell eh? Might as well keep her where we can keep an eye on her. E Ega... Yes. Distressing as it may be, that's true. <laughs> more to the point, you simply want her to be some place where you can easily protect her. Our rough raven wishes to be a white knight. How chivalrous, how manly. Oh, given that look, I think Olivia's right on the mark. Um, um, is that true? Don't listen to anything that idiot says. Look, you better be able to pull your own weight, got it? Don't get so lost in messing with machines, you do something stupid. <laughs> I'll be careful. <laughs> well, good to see that settled. <laughs> it's good to see our group getting so lively. Oh, it's getting more members. Eh. I have to swap in and swap out with them. Eh? <laughs> I don't know who to use. And there's so many. And every character you bring, in, there's different dialogue there. Ah, uh, there's different possibility of dialogues, and like, you you miss out so many things. Tita, do take care. Can I just bring the whole group along? Okay, so in this game, like. Most of the JRPG, uh, it, you can only bring four, four people into battle with you. So four people in a party at any given time. So these four will progress along with the story while the others will like chill somewhere else. Then if any dialogue happen, it will happen with these four. So and every character has a unique dialogue with the given situation. So it's like it sucks like you just. So I think now there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, six members. So you miss out two members worth of interaction in that given situation you are in. Which yeah if you want to see their dialogue you have to replay the game or which kind of annoying uh not not the type of thing I would do uh because I'm the I'm the once and done kind of person. <laughs> then when they walk they can be on both ends of the world at <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it, it doesn't work that way, unfortunately. Yeah, most of the game, they don't allow you to bring a full, the full force of your party. It's normally like 3, 4. I think there are some games which allows more, uh, 8 or so. But yeah, most of the time, it's like, or rather the older games, yeah, they only allow this much. That's gatekeeping, yeah. And this game is very famous for having a very huge uh, script. And most of the scripts are like, yeah, that's why, that's why like you'll miss out a fair amount of scripts uh, or dialogue 
for certain given characters. Uh, depends on what you bring into your party. Like for this chapter itself, right, we have like, uh, previously we have five different characters. So I couldn't bring Olivia along with me, which is uh, the white guy in code. So I missed out uh, his dialogue for the whole of this uh, chapter actually, which is a bit unfortunate because he's like the funny guy, man. He talks a lot, of, he talks a lot of weird shit. <laughs> That sucks. They don't even read for you. Yeah. Actually, there is a... Uh, uh, how to say? Voice acting? But voice acting only applies in Japanese. And you have to download a patch for it, which I'm too lazy. But... And and I figured that, like... I've been reading it in English for, like, the past games. It would be too weird to suddenly change to Japanese. So I was like, ah, forget it lah. I'll just continue doing what I've been doing for this game. Plus, I think uh, further down the game, there there is actually a, a certain level of voice act, uh, voice acting, which is a bit weird for the game because they voice act certain parts and they don't voice act certain parts. And it's all related to the main story as well, which is even weirder. I don't know, I don't know what is their decision for it. You have to read in English along with the chat too. Yeah, yeah. Um, Actually, no, I'll, I'll just listen to a Jap, then like read the English in my mind, most of, uh, if that, that's the case. <laughs> I wouldn't want to read it twice, man. That would be too, too time consuming. Uh. Like imagine you have to wait for them to read, finish the dialogue, then you start reading yourself, then start reading in English yourself. That is like twice the time I, I will take to clear the games. Uh. I'll take care of unraveling the mystery of this gospel business while you're gone. Don't worry. Okay. Good luck, Grandpa. Don't worry too much about Professor Russell, everyone. I'll keep both eyes on him and make sure he doesn't cause any catastrophes. I'm counting on you, Mr. Murdoch. Oh, don't you have a church or something to run off to, Mr. Murdoch? <laughs> I'll contact Elnan at Grand Cell Guildhouse. May the blessing of she who dwells above be with you. Take care on your journey. Alright, time to see if there's any side quests. Woo, end of chapter 2. Sweet. Time to save. Ooh, the raging land. That's the achievement we get. Oh. Some. After end of chapter cutscenes. I think we'll. This is Joshua side, right? Maybe. Oh, oh, this is on Casey's side. Leiston Fortress. <laughs> All the engineer from the factory came over. To do what? Oh, oh, this is their new sh airship. The actually they have finally finished testing. So the R sales arrive, eh? Ah damn. Every time I see this ship, my heart skips a bit. I hear your boss. Who needs a guy or a girl when you can fall in love with something like that? Don't think there's an engineer alive who deserve to work on her every day though. Ha, <laughs> that's my line. Maintenance Chief Gustav, thank you for coming. I know you have been busy. Hey Sid, wasn't expecting you to come greet us. <coughs> I thought you'd move up in the world and left behind your job as garrison commander here. <laughs> well, I have. I'm intending to leave aboard on a patrol ship with my men later on. Until then, however, I'm free. So I thought I may as well come and greet you. Ha, <laughs> well, good luck with the patrol at least. Oh yeah, wasn't there an earthquake around here a bit ago? You didn't let anything happen to our, the Arceal, did you? No, the Arceal was in the air during the earthquake. The earthquake caused little damage in general, in fact. We were prepared in advance for it. Our facility should still be perfect for your needs. Good to hear. Anyhow, we'd love to get down to work, but I'm wondering... Where are all the Royal Guard folks? Ah, here. Let me show you. We should be just in time for a bit of a show. Huh?
Bro, really eh, the, the longkang cover ah, I don't know what's wrong or what PNG they put over it. Eh. It looks like a puppy, a, looks like a golden retriever puppy or something eh. I, I cannot take it off my mind. <laughs> Why? Why is it like that? <laughs> it's like they just paste a PNG over it or something. <laughs> Combatants at the ready. And begin. Uh, yeah. Oh, he's still using his pole. Ugh. Julia, your attacks are too predictable. With a rapier, you should be able you should be able to overwhelm me with moves only possible with a light blade. Remember what I taught you and come at me again. Sir. Yes sir. So much fleshy movement. Good, that's better. And now my turn. kicked again. Ugh. Defense is the same way. Build an image of the flow of battle in your mind. Offense and defense. And use it to predict your force of movements. Yeah, what, what did they actually paste on the PNG? Uh, paste on the... Yeah, I really don't know. I can't tell. The... So, I yeah. Woo! Whoa! At this rate, she could summon a clone of herself, eh? <coughs> Isn't that very tiring to keep doing that? Ooh. Enough. I call the match. <sighs> Not a whit less than I expected. I only taught you the bearers of the basics all those years ago, but you have come far on your own, Julia. Well done. No, sir. My performance was shameful. I... Ah, could not best you. Don't disparage yourself, Swartz. That was a fairly impressive display. But, General, you remember who you are fighting, Captain. I have yet to meet a man or woman who can match blades with cases without having their swords swept from their hand in a, few, in a few strokes. You did very well for yourself. I see why Cassius and the Majesty place such stock in you. Th thank you, sir. Still, a chance to practice like this doesn't come up very often. I'd like to continue until I'm truly unable to fight if you don't mind. I'm gonna go sleep sleep. Okay, okay, have a good rest of Poki. Good night, good night. Thank you for dropping by. A good Friday to rest early. Yes, a good Friday to rest early and have prepare the energy for the weekends. Oh, thanks for the hydrate redeem. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> good. Well, Cassius, up for risking a skewering again? She may well manage it this time. 99, they have one with rest of the stream too. Yes, yes, thank you. I will. Well, I'd be humbled to get poked down a pack. But I believe we have a visitor. Don't forget Delulu and Hepe. <laughs> yes, yes, I will party through the night. <laughs> Ha! Dang! If that wasn't one heck of a show. Well fought, both of you. Captain Swartz, that was very impressive. Lieutenant Colonel Sid. And the man with you is... <laughs> Maintenance Chief Gustav, ma'am. The Central Factory sent me over. Nice to meet you, Captain. Oh, pardon me. <coughs> I am Captain Julia Swartz, Company Commander of the Royal Guard. It's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. Gustav. Hmm, it seems that will be all for today then. 
All right, let's show us over. Back to your post. So, do 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 do. All tower. So mind showing me to the Arceus engine room. I like to get an idea of how we are going to attack this. Certainly, follow me. You have to excuse me, General Morgan, General Bright. General, thank you very much for your guidance. Ha, <laughs> not at all. These old bones needed to work out anyway. Captain, Mr. Gustav, take care with the Arceu. Sir, no worries, General. The Arceu's like my baby. I won't let her down. Captain Schwartz has gotten quite impressive. I swear, she's even better than when I saw her last. Yes, she's come a long way, very quickly. Even now, she's only a step or two below you and Richard Colonel. And she can only grow. Indeed, watching youth on display like that gives me back a bit of my old drive. Cassius, how about it? I'll give you a screwing later if you're up for it. Uh, Morgan, I'm not sure it'd be the best idea at your age. Mm. Besides, I heard you did quite well for yourself at last year's grand tournament in Grand Cell. You have to let the young folks have their moment occasionally. Hmm. <laughs> Why do you think I gave you command? If you can say that, how about you stop complaining and, complaining and do your job, hmm? Ouch. Put that my foot right into that hornet's nest. <laughs> Speaking of Hornet's Nest, Lieutenant Colono, I believe you will be assigned to the Guard Patrol? Yes sir, I'll be leaving at noon. I'll be using three companies and two patrol ships. I'll be at the signing ceremony itself, but I won't be free until then. You are in charge of the defense of Grand Cell until then. Leave it to me sir. I'll be sure to work well with the Bracer Guild to make sure that nothing happens. Hmm. I don't like it, but I suppose we have little choice but to lean on those civilians this time. <laughs> Warming up to the guild a little, Morgan? <laughs> oh no. Something's aiming the fortress? Watchtowers. Orbo sensors. Oh, her. A mine, harbour, and gun emplacements covering all approaches. A perfect defense in every way. If that's the way you want to play, Cassius Bright, I'll just have to change the rules of the game a little as suggested. Sir, just wait a little bit longer. Your freedom is coming soon, Colonel. I promise. Oh, she's planning her own breakout. The Mad Tea Party. Chapter 3. What time are we? Oh, 1230. Not bad, not bad. Please form your party. You may choose two other members of fight aside from the mandatory members. Who is mandatory? Oh. Healer and a ranger. Let's, let's choose these two for now. Okay, next stop, Grand Cell. We'll head to the lock once everyone's ready. Given that it's the military, which, you know, means your dad calling, we might want to hurry. Still, if we got any jobs left or shopping to do, we can take care of that, my bad. Off we go. Alright, first thing first, let me get to the grocery store. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, the gen general goods store, not grocery store. I want to buy... Do I have this? I do have it, so... Okay, that... Uh, not needed, then. <laughs> Missing gas. Oh, that's one new one. Gas left to do, touring and failed to return a specific day and time. We'll have to investigate. Front desk at a hotel. I see. Okay, let's do this quest, then we end off the stream, then. Toku. Welcome to the Zan Rat Hotel. Do you have a reservation? Sorry, that's not why we are here. We came from the guild. Oh, are you braces? Pardon me, we have been waiting for you. Can you begin the search immediately? Yep, no problem. Uh, 
The request mentioned a customer hasn't returned in some time. So in other words, they are missing? Yes, that's exactly the case. It's been long gone for three days. Oh, why did I add long? Hmm. Three days, huh? That is kind of worrisome. Lately, the monsters on the road have been pretty nasty too. I almost wish that was where he had gone. This particular guest, he's gone to the limestone cave. Oh. The limestone cave? The one that's like in the middle of the Caldea tunnel? Yes, exactly. The Caldea limestone cave. We tried to stop him, but... Whoa, whoa, you're kidding, right? That place is a monster pit. I can't believe this. Why go there without an escort? Who was this crazy guest? He seemed to be a fairly ordinary young man. They check in as Jimmy from Ruan. Jimmy, Jimmy from Ruan? C could it be? You know him? Yeah, I've done a job for someone with that name before. As I recall, it was a treasure hunt of some kind. Most likely, he went to a limestone cave searching for something again. Oh, that guy, the pirate one. We best away to limestone cave immediately. If fortune doesn't favor this young man, we might already be too late. Yeah, we should hurry. Got any other information? I've told everything I can. Please take care of our guests. We are on it. Let's move. Yeah. Come. Hopefully you found your treasure this time. But considering there's a third game. Uh, like uh, in Libro at the very least. We he might not have found anything yet. Or probably found a clue to the next treasure instead. Which means more job for us to find him the next time around. Unfortunate, but oh well. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. Eh, Latin? No, no, I'm going to... Uh, what? No wonder. I went in the wrong exit. Nope, nope. Going into a stronger area, so. Oh? When we came by and patrol the chains on the limestone came brocade were broken. The sandbags were moved too. Talk about irresponsible. What if someone wanders in there by mistake? If possible, it's possible someone got in. Has there been any contact at the guild? Yep, there is. That's why we are going in. Oh, what is this actually? Is that a crab? I can't tell. The monster looks. The monster design looks so complicated for pixel <laughs> that that I can't tell what what it is. I took the chest and ran away. Haha. <laughs> Voila. All right, time to uh, explore mapless cave again, which is unfortunate. But oh well. Doom -doom. Fight, fight, fight. How many EXP, I wonder? 38. Not too bad, not too bad. And there's only two mobs, so it's fairly decent. Oh, we are tanky. Also 36. Huh. Not worth it then. <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh, hello Q. Ended your stream. Did you manage to finish? Uh, yeah, or, or uh, the, the, I don't know, the, the chapter or the whole story? Oh, I can't remember, was it 36 chapter? Yeah, we were at th chapter 31, right? So, yeah, just the chapter? Du, 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 du. I don't know where to go, actually. Hello, brother. Yes, hello, sister. Hello, Neshi. Hello, Ella. How are you? Did you just reach home or something? <laughs> Ooh, 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 pain. Beast. No la. <laughs> oh my god, why did he mad so long? <laughs> I mean, sometimes when you when you keep come by, then you always like, oh, I'm I'm just starting to eat dinner now. <laughs> so I thought that might be the case again. But very happy. You don't need to work this weekend. Hey, good for you. Shook. Sure. That means you can take a break. Any plans or not this weekend? Or you just going to Noah at home? And be the 
couch potato we are we are built for. Hey, penguin. Just stay at home, eat, watch YouTube. <laughs> Is there anything in YouTube these days? I like I I, I really watch until I keep replaying the same content with this. Uh. <laughs> I don't know, I just watch people play games. I see. Then never go play yourself, man. Oh, actually, do you watch the Wuthering Waves? Of uh, course, they're having closed beta now, so a lot of people have been reviewing the new stuff or reviewing the gameplay. New gameplay stuff for it. No, lazy. <laughs> I mean, you can play and watch at the same time, then, you know, twice the efficiency, eh. I just watched the trailers. <laughs> Is it cause you don't want to spoil yourself of more and like so you can experience it when you get the time? <laughs> it's okay, Genshin will be more than enough to keep you busy uh, either way. If you are not going <laughs> if you are not playing other games, just playing Genshin is time consuming enough. Where am I going man? When it comes out then see how. <coughs> I see, yeah, yeah, you'll probably take a while, so no rush. Where am I going? Where am I even? Bruh. Ouch. Hey, why are you just coming in to throw one and, <laughs> and out? Hey, hey, hey. <coughs> really flexing with the point there. Eh? Are you done with your stream, man? Thank you. Throw one by one. Yeah, that's what he's doing. He's been doing all along, man. <laughs> oh. Oh. We found it. That that, yes, nice. That means you finished the chapter already, or is it like there's, the I mean the chapter, the current chapter you want to finish. I only managed to finish chapter thirty. Oh, oh, I thought you wanted to finish chapter thirty one. Is it too long? Ah, <laughs> okay. I I managed to pull the chest up. No doubt about it. I finally found it. Yeah, I finally found it. I think need enough two hours to finish. Oh boy. Can I until 2 a.m. Uh. <laughs> Just play until 2 a.m. <laughs> finally found it. Found it. 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 <laughs> the echo, man. No, why not? Hey Stella, why suddenly your <laughs> why suddenly your VIP and the sub badge gone? Sia? <laughs> oh wait, what? Amazing! I love you, love you, you, you. I want to sleep. <laughs> Is that you going to the gym early again tomorrow? <coughs> it's back. What do you mean by it's back? Ah, I guess this isn't a time to be goofing around. Tomorrow 9 a.m. Wow, that's early. The sub bag. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, it's back. Maybe it was, it was gone for like one, one <laughs> message for some reason. Relatable, yeah, Nashi. <laughs> you can sleep in tomorrow uh, since you don't have work anyway. I better check out the content before monster. Yeah, uh, yeah. Whoa, who are you guys? Forget that. What the heck are you doing in the place? Playing around in a place like this. Are you nuts? Yeah, so tired of overtime every day. Ah, uh, wow. I, that busy, yeah, uh, that you need to overtime every day. Yeah, you tell you. Oh my god. Will it get better soon? Oblivious as always. You haven't changed a bit. Huh? You, you are? Hey, Jimmy, it's been a while. When did I take that job of yours back in Ruan? <coughs> oh man, that takes me back. Yeah, some more me only. Wait, why only you? Why why the others don't need to OT? Huh? You you carrying the whole team, ah? <coughs> yeah, it'll be better soon. <laughs> Yes, yes, good, good, good that it'll be better soon. Because I pro. Simis, yeah. <laughs> because you pro, then they throw all the job to you, man. Cannot be, what? 
So, uh, what brings you here? Your lodging put out a search request, so we came looking for you. Oh, you came all the way from Zeis, huh? Well, sorry, but I can't go back yet. I'm, I'm about to make the discovery of the century. Are you speaking of the chest? Yeah, I managed to put it up just a moment ago. I get the harder shit. <laughs> Sounds weird. <laughs> yes, I get it. <laughs> I get the bigger projects because I'm more familiar with them. Oh. Then no one to help you, man. I mean, other than, uh, than the intern. Uh. I mean, I don't know if the intern is helping you or making more work for you, but yeah. No one else to help you with your project, man. Yeah. Pull it up, like from the lake. Yeah, talk about crazy hiding spot. Still, that's what I expect for the great pirate Shkamir's treasure. What? That's the treasure you have been looking for? <laughs> no doubt about it. I followed a long trial and many old maps to get here. Look, I don't care whose damn treasure it is, just hurry up. If we hang around here, the monsters are going to notice us. Whoa, yeah, right. Oh, alright, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna open the chest. What, why are you quiet all of a sudden? G give me a second. What? What is this? Whoa, whoa, Ooh, that sure surprised me. Uh, anyone else hear that? Oh man, this is so a trap, isn't it? Don't know, but I got a bad feeling. Oh, 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 all the penguins are coming. Hey, your pre premonition was correct. They got other projects to do too. Then the deadline is all like trash. So I do faster, so I don't count the interns, so only two editors only. Oh, wow. Oh, you're, you're. <laughs> You're really accepting uh very hardcore projects, ah. Uh. <laughs> oh, but there's oh yeah, I I, I do. You, you did say that your company was like a fairly small company. No wonder. Check no child's ah uh, got big client. <laughs> yeah, sometimes yeah, especially if the money. The money we are getting from them is like, ooh, shook. Marriott. Is that the company's name? Let me see. M. Ooh. Ooh, hotel. Ooh. Someone is long term client. Oh. Oh, yeah. Then, then even more. If you want to maintain good relationship with them, then it's like Bopian. <laughs> Hotel chain, yeah, yeah, I just saw, I just saw, wow. Shook. Do they, you, you, do they like give you like discounts for hotel or not? <laughs> After you finish your project. <laughs> the enemy is upon us. No man, aww, Satch. Penguins, woo. Meh, 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 meh. Oh, I, I just realized those are small penguins. Ah. Whoa, there are tons of them. Jimmy, behind you. Oh, oh, the big penguin. If I'm not wrong. Huh? What the fuck? Uh, those are so cute. <laughs> yeah, they are like very dopey birds. Oh my god, then this, this big ass penguin got a peacock tail. Uh. <laughs> oh, they kind of broke. Oh, the... The hotel is broke. What? Oh, um, yeah, probably maybe because of the COVID situation previously, they have to catch up with their earnings. <laughs> yeah, never mind this one. Not <laughs> this is like the king or queen, man. Hey, but the yeah, but the small one, the triplets, is legit cute. Uh. Another evil penguin. Surprise, surprise. Heads up, here it comes. Yeah, probably recovering from COVID time. Yeah, COVID really hit them hard, man. Especially a lot of times they are used for quarantine areas, so they have no cho no choice but to listen to the government. <laughs> Green penguin, baby penguin, pink penguin. What a simple name they have, I swear. 
Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Mac, 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 mac. Wow, 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 pin, pin, pin. And most of our videos is event niche. So now stuff opening up, they asked to make a lot of videos. Since now they're starting to do events already. Oh, yeah, yeah, makes sense, makes sense. They gotta <laughs> pay up front first in order to recoup back their losses. <laughs> okay, let's let's put Agat in front and go and smack that big ass bird. Like. Birdo, birdo. Uh, then. What, what are we against? Nothing. Fire and wind. Uh, nothing at eh? Gonna brush teeth? Okay, okay. Go ahead and go ahead and brush your teeth. Sniper shot, happy trigger, quick draw. Right. Eat bullets. Sure, I can. How many will I hit? Yeah, let's hit this one. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Ooh, oh my god. Bro, don't go and attack the civilian, eh? Can fear? Oh, miss. What the? I think I can do combat. It doesn't? No, it doesn't. Patch. Yeah, I think True Hurricane will probably kill. Oh, it doesn't. Heal Estella, Estella. Oh my god. Oh my god, why do you miss? Whoa, 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 what the? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna use item to... Oh my god. Confuse. Take that. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Ooh! Item. Okay, nice, nice. Br br die! Okay, nice. Oh my god, I need to... Oh. Petrify... Oh. Confuse... Where is... Where is paralysis? Mute. Confuse, blind, faint. Sleep, KO, seal, defense, poison, blind, freeze, poison, KO. Hmm? Okay. Oh, I can still use arts. Okay, that's fine then. Oh my god. Seriously? Actually, 
Oh, it doesn't work. God. Oh no. <laughs> Jala. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Such annoyingness. Okay, that's fine. I'm just gonna attack here. Wash. I really cannot have her have status ailments. Eh. <laughs> She's the main healer. Eh, really. oh, I really. I need to go find an equipment that. That prevents her from getting any form of Satan's ailments, to be honest. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Well, well, that was certainly a thing. Ribbon for the win. Yeah, I really need something like that. Yeah. Especially when she's the healer. Eh. <laughs> wow. That was okay now to rely on all the items I've accumulated. I, I I thought I was a goner. Only one healer. Yeah, she's the only healer in the party. Then the other two no the the rest are all DPS. Technically there's one more healer la, but but I wouldn't say she's a healer so la. Sub healer I guess at most. Okay. We managed to push them back, hmm? Still, it seems best if we were to make our exit swiftly. R right. O okay then, I'll be quick. Hold up. Leave that to us. That could be another trap. Y yeah, good point. Well then, here we go. Hmm, nothing seems off really. I think we are okay, but... Silver do up. Alright. The dubious pirate treasure has been secured. Wait, huh? What, what's wrong? There's a scrap of paper in here. It looks like a letter. Let's see. In memory of my 70th birthday and my retirement from piracy, here lies my silver dew orb. This gem holds the power to warn its bearer of all approaching danger. I can say my living to this day is thanks to none other than this jewel <laughs> and and it's more like this is more like a prank than any other thing eh? <laughs> however i have grown old and worried of being bothered by the knights who come seeking it so i sink it into this lake you who have found it do as you please however as i wrote this treasure comes with its own troubles scammer the end Holy crap! Let, let, let me see it, please! Oh, okay, okay, calm down. Zay's first, then I'll let you have it. Though, if you'd rather fight that weird monster again, we can hang around. P pass. Going, going is good. A wise decision. Yes, let us be gone. Yeah, let's. Let's go! Woo! That was a very near thing. If you open the chest first, you'll likely be monster food now. Whoa, monster food? I, I totally regret it, so please don't scare me like that. We are not trying to scare you, but you are really you really were saved by a coincidence this time. Understand that and make sure you learn something. G -g Got it. Anyway, I'm going to focus on getting a job for now so I can pay for an escort next time. So, so that's how it's gonna be. You may regret it, but you are still going into danger, huh? But, well, yeah, I gotta. Treasures hunting a man's romance. For discoveries like this, a little danger is unavoidable. Uh, this is not a little at all, man. That penguin is hardcore. 
It makes you dime disco and get you confused. <laughs> Speaking of, what happened to the discovery this time? It seems it really was a pirate treasure in the end. Ah, right, right. Anyway, I need to return the treasure to Jimmy. Hand it over, silver deal up. Th thank you. It's like a dream come true to really find treasure. Hmm, still, I wonder what it really is. Whatever it is, it sounds pretty incredible, judging by the letter that was left with it. Th that's true, but I've never seen anything like this before. It's most likely an artifact. From the look of it, however, its power has long since left it. What? An artifact? Artifacts are relics from a long time ago, right? Even if it doesn't have any power, isn't it still pretty dangerous? Yes, you should go get it investigated through the proper channels. I can't really recommend individual possession of it given their nature. The closest research facility would be the History Museum in the capital. If you wish, I could contact them for you. P please do. If it's that dangerous, i definitely like to have it looked at. Understood. Well then, I'll prepare everything including your ticket to the capital. Wow, thanks. What great service. No, it's a necessary expense. After all, you are completely broke, aren't you? What? How, how did you? <laughs> That's our Kilika. But the way things are outside right now, it's probably best for you to take up her up on the offer anyway. Walking the roads is just way too scary at the moment. Yeah, absolutely. You can get our ticket. Uh, get, uh, you can get your ticket from the receptionist at the landing port. Well then, take care on your way to the capital. Really, thanks for today. No, thinking about it, it's not just today. I owe you guys a lot from before too. Here, take this. Yin Yang Quartz. Ooh, it's a favorite of mine. I like you to have it. Are you sure? It's a sign of my thanks for saving my butt so many times. Please accept it. Hope we see each other in the capital. Yeah, got it. Make sure to deliver the jewel to the museum. Yeah, leave it to me. Missing guess. Oh, we are done. Okay, report. Okay. If you complete, okay. Okay, now we are all done here. We left Grand Cell. I can't believe we have like three, three. 3 to 10, so 7 chapters more to go eh? Like how, how, how much more content can they squeeze out? So, yeah, we only have like 3 more regions to go I think Or uh, in Libro where, where else are we going after we finish these 5 regions man? Hey, welcome! You are the party of the braces bound for Grand Cell, right? Yeah, that's us Kilika sent over the fair payment already You guys ready to check in? As usual, we should stick around and wait for the ship once we check in you sure we are all done here in this? Uh, still. Well, once you are done with your business, let's say the word. Just say the word, I mean. Okay. I think I'm going to end it here for today. Let me let me save first actually. We will continue um chapter three stuff next week. Since yeah, the the portion for flying to where? Grand Cell will take a while as well since there are dialogues in the ship then dialogues after the ship as well I think I assume so like in like from chapter 1 to 2 as well it actually took quite a while and I don't want to drag it out <laughs> bye bye hey welcome back Nashi <laughs> yes yes bye bye <laughs> we are going to let me let me see who to read actually oh no Okay, I know who. Wait, is, is it? Is it still on? Wait, she's sleeping. She's sleeping. Then, never mind, I guess. <laughs> Bruh, she's having a donor toilet. And <laughs> she's sleeping already. So fast. Okay, I guess I'll read someone else. <laughs> Alright, actually, let's just see. Sub first? What, what thing? Sub first? What, who's subbing? Oh, thank you for the sub. Welcome. Oh, th thank you for the sub, Nashi. Oh, I thought I. Oh, I. I thank you, thank you. Thank you for the one month sub. Credit card bill just reset. 
Wait, <laughs> what? When you mean reset, how much did you spend that that you max that you managed to max it out? <laughs> or oh, is there like a limit? You <laughs> nearly high if you managed to max it out. <laughs> but yes, yes. Thank you, thank you for the resub. For them, not resub. Thank you, thank you for the sub. <laughs> Appreciate it. No? It's because I under a shared card thing. Oh. Who are you sharing with? And I don't want my mom see. Oh, oh. If I spend a lot. A lot. <laughs> what? Actually, why you don't want to get your own card if that's the case? I think. I think you probably can go and uh, apply for your own card. Eh? Yeah. But I don't know. Maybe that's a good thing. Because. You you will ha at least have a level of self control if that's the case. <laughs> Last time I used the card, pay quite a lot. <laughs> then then she questioned you, is it? <laughs> okay, Leme. Okay, I think I think we can read. Is she still going? I lazy I don't want to see the account or handle transaction error thing. <laughs> no lah, I think she'll be fine lah. If you just if you just make a bank card and like uh sign up for pay now pay lah for it, then should be fine. But yeah, true, it helps to control. Yeah, yeah, that's a upside for it lah. But the downside for it is just that maybe when you want to spend something, then you have to like the sneaky sneaky yeah. <laughs> That's the only downside. Just in case your mom starts questioning you about your questionable expenses. <laughs> Alright. Let me... Hello, nowadays she don't really... <laughs> 是不是因为长大了,然后他就没有管这样多了? <laughs> yeah, I don't get to read her very often anyway. So yeah, we can read Miyori, she... Wait, Otsu? She's ending? Okay, I think she's ending, so... <laughs> That's a good night, good night. Yeah, 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 thank you, thank you. Good night to you too, have a good rest and... Enjoy your weekend. Wait, uh, let me check. See Sims 4, and then we'll see if we have any um other VTubers. VTuber. Yes, she's reading already. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Let's find someone else. Yeah, I know. I was thinking like, hey, then end up. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. We shall read. Uh, who? Both of you reach each other's ending. <laughs> that would be chaotic, man. <laughs> Shiari? Oh, oh, Shiari's playing, huh? Uh, eh? Where, where did the thing go? Oh, I think I closed it by accident. Ah, yeah, never mind lah. I'll just read. Aries lah. She's also playing an RPG, so we can go about it. I didn't read Shiari before already, anyway. So, yeah. Before I end, I guess as always, this is the dish called. This is the socials. Yeah, if you want notification, you can follow Discord or Twitter. Other than that, I I I I do upload a bit on YouTube and TikTok. Uh, so yeah, and then we'll be reading Aries. She's playing Xeno Chronicles. Oh, I don't have a Switch to play that game, man. I wanted to try it too, but uh, maybe if it comes on Steam, maybe. This is the sub read message. And this is the raid message. If you guys are interested, you guys can use this message and follow through the raid. So yes, yes, we'll be ending in a bit. 
and yeah good night good night have a good day have a good rest wherever you guys are i'll see you guys when i see you guys good night bye bye